know what I'm saying? Like, you got a song with Taylor Swift, my G. Like, yeah. Drake doesn't need a song with Taylor Swift to be on Taylor Swift's level. No. But that also plays a or, factor or in does court. Does him yeah, and the security guard have a, have a relationship? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Uh, what do you think the man for? Just crazy. <laughs> what do you just the man for? Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm. You're going to Scarborough. Scarborough's not known for Jamaican food. Hey, yo, chill. Yeah, yeah, Sorry, yeah. Scarborough has a lot of didn't, food, though. Didn't he it try don't Jamaican have good food. food. It, it has haka spots, bro. Pure haka. He's, <laughs> he's like, when he's like, I want to tell you guys something. <laughs> and he smiled for like. <laughs> I was like, he about to tell us what he really is. No. We love hip hop. Really skeptical. There's a lot going on. There is a lot going on. I'm excited to get this podcast and going on today. Sorry for the lateness, guys. It's all good. I still sold my phone. Okay. All right. <laughs> we got action from what what you your three y'all are saying. Is the is the track is is, is it here? We ready? Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> you know what? Let, let's not. Yo, you don't think if he actually did the track. He wouldn't have just dropped it on surprise, like surprised everybody and just dropped it like that. It would have had more of an impact than having a leak come out and then, you know, like. But most leaks are not planned, right? Like, but they're Drake, normally like some kind of hacking or some kind Drake's of like. Drake's leaks are planned. All of them? Everything you can. When, when have you heard of a Drake leak other than his picture? When Moji leaked his <laughs> track. <laughs> the video. <laughs> um. <laughs> Yeah, Moji did leak his track. You remember he leaked his track yeah. on on live or whatever, but the names. Yeah, like maybe you send it to one person and that person sends it to. But Drake's not gonna send it to one person. He's he's in the studio with forty. Boom, let's get it done. Out. You don't think people are or, getting some airdrops? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like he probably. I don't know. Who's man. he airdropping that 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 big of a uh, of a track to? Boys, you, you guys called this. Hey, a what do you track? think? <laughs> no, I'm okay. saying Hold the on. situation. Like the track he's gonna make is yeah. now the biggest, talk, most talked about track that everybody in the world is gonna be talking about. Everybody's focused, Facts. hyper right. focused, most on anticipated. And, and, and this piece of work that we just got right now is not the, worth, the, the most, most talked about track <laughs> in the world. You know what I mean? So. Okay. That guy Look at the title. Yo. Probably genuine, not AI. Yeah. Like, <laughs> okay, so let me play. It. Okay, for the for the listening audience, we just started the pod. I have a whole bunch of other things on the list, in, including Drake topics, but. In real time, Saturday morning for the people we, we usually film this, there, there's a song that's out right now. It's an hour ago. <laughs> the podcast gods have blessed us. Maybe. 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 So let's let's hear this. Skeptical about it. <laughs> no, AI. Hey, nah. Get it out of here. <laughs> I could never be nobody number one fan. Your first number one, I had to put it in your hand. Oh, this can't oh. put a side chain off of us. How the fuck you been stepping with a side seven men on? Whoa. That might be that might be real. Nah, if it didn't come out, if what does your gut instinct tell you? Nah, it I'm it not taking in any of these bars because if it didn't come from Champagne's page. I'm going through my phone. I gotta check Instagram. Yeah, <laughs> if it's not on, if it's not on Champagne's page, it don't make it don't make no yeah, sense. If you don't post it on the story, it don't make sense. Yeah, if it's it not, could have got leaked. But I do agree with B3 that there is something in the high frequencies of his vocals that sound a little go, unusual. Go listen to a Ghostwriter track. That, Hold on, with, Alex Media. Big salute to Alex Media. He works on Flagrant. With, he's the black guy on Flagrant. Yeah. <laughs> okay. The black yeah. guy. Right. And he's on, on Brilliant Idiots with uh, Andrew and Charlemagne. Right. Yeah, Alex. Yeah. This is on his page right now. Okay. So I'm not saying he's the all he's the source for hip hop news, <laughs> but I'm just saying if Joe Budden posts it, oh. I feel like the new media will run with it as genuine, whether it's AI or not. Like people nah, are picking it up and resharing nah, it because of the because, anticipation. No, that's a setup on Drake because then Lamar is gonna kick his butt if this is the if this is like you know what I'm saying if this is all he's coming with. You don't the, think it's fire? Well, let's, let's hear it, man. It was like, it's, it's, it's high. We, we, it's we, high. We, we have a really, this is a really a different rolling intro today. <laughs> you you could have caught that. I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. AI computer. Weak. Hmm. The way AI works is it's somebody else writing the bar, somebody else performing the cadence and rapping it, and then you put it into AI and it gives you the voice, right? But if your voice yeah. is way off, right, then you're going to get a little bit of a hiss and a little bit of a yeah. weird... Some artifacts. Yeah. Some artifacts, right? And that's yeah. what I'm hearing. 
I'm, I will. I'll feel. Hey, you, hey, you're an engineer. You got the ear. Yeah, yeah I'm hearing that. And yo, and I heard it as soon as I heard it. You don't think Drake would have came back back with some harder bars than that, bro? Like, Very much so. Kendrick went straight for the throw. Pause. Like, yeah. but like seriously, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, from my sources, no I've been told that he has two songs ready. Yeah, so this so could be I. the first one. This might be just a warning shot. Remember when he did charged up? Um, frick, we should start the podcast. <laughs> this is so crazy. We just ran right into the topic. Right well, who cares? Yeah. Um. When he did Charged Up, it was kind of... Eh, it, it was mid. It, I won't say mid. That's a little bit harsh. Okay. But it wasn't as we expected. It wasn't back-to-back, obviously. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. We were like, that's, that's it? Okay. All right. Cool. But when back-to-back dropped, it was yeah. the Came uppercut. with the knockout. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So this might be another yeah. Charged Up moment right here. I don't know. Okay. You know what? I agree with B3. I don't know. <laughs> Listen, bro, he's got... They pump faking they, us bad yo, right now. Yo, Metro and Future got everybody against him. Yeah. Like, everybody against him. You don't think Drake would have came out and... Bah, 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 Cole, bah, I got one for Jay you, Cole. got one for you, got Red one for leather. you. Red Have you heard Red Leather? Bro, yeah. Cole switched sides. He switched sides. Like, what's going on? You don't think Drake would have been like, everybody's going to get one now? Like, I'm going to go for the whole Let team? Like, oh, okay, man. I have a question, though. Should he drop, when he drops the diss track to address all the other diss tracks, should he drop a video with it? Or is like, sure. he never dropped a video for back to back. Exactly. Yeah. That's a diss record. Just go hard. Pause. Yeah. As long as it serves as per. Well, you know what? Like that got a video, though. Yeah. 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 Okay, let's play a little bit more of this and then let's actually introduce the damn podcast because this is crazy. This is like breaking news. <laughs> Live. Whoa. Mm. This might be real still. Yo, I've, I, I heard it when it's like witty. <laughs> Yeah, it's not only that, like the bars that he is saying, like he's saying some true shit about Kendrick Lamar. Yeah. Right. Because Kendrick, no matter how much everybody talks about, he's so pro-black, Mr. Activist guy. All his big major hits are like with pop stars, bro. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like you got a song with Taylor Swift, my G. Like yeah. Drake doesn't need a song with Taylor Swift to be on Taylor Swift's level. No. But but I will say, are these all, is this all public information though? Yeah, we all, we we know this, right? This is what the things that people song? debate about. No, the... Um, yeah, yeah, just so, the fact that he does pop yeah, songs. So it's blood it's, was it's not hard for a super fan to be like, like make bars like that. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> you know? I'm, I'm very no, skeptical. you're not wrong. And, until he says something, if he has a bar in there that's like nobody knows about, mm. like it's like hidden information that maybe yeah. only Drake would know or his people's, then maybe, yeah, yeah Drake did it. But like... Yeah. Yo, low key. If you let V three lose for the AI machine, he's gonna go crazy. Yeah, yo. If this is, if this isn't AI, then it fuck. I'll, I'm not an engineer. I'll quit. He knows. He seems to know a lot about AI and what you can and what you can't do. Oh, man. Is AI writing these tunes for you? Oh, too? Are you using AI? AI? Come to V three Studios. We'll get you a Drake check. Come on. <laughs> a little bit too much, bro. AI B three. Bi. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see here. Pip squeak pipe down. Pip squeak. Reese's a got you white down. Travis got you white down. Savage got you white down. Ooh. Like your label boy, you in a scope right now. Ooh. <laughs> like your label, you in the scope right now. That's a hard buyer. That's a hard buyer stuff. Mm, with that AI V3. Yeah, what about that V3? <laughs> Yo, Ghost Rider has some crazy buyers too, bro. I'm not like. I know. True. I know. Ghost so. Rider kind of got a hot pen still. <laughs> hot. Say, I could do this like Drake. Oh, man. And, and the weekend. <laughs> and the weekend. I think we're hyping, though, bro. I don't Please wanna... don't be AI, man. <laughs> I know. That's yeah, what I'm no. saying. Don't get me wrong. I don't want it to be AI. I don't want it to be AI. But it's, you know. Wow. I, just, I can't believe these, age. these half-steppers anymore, right? So it's like. It's not Drake, you know, I'm worried about. It, 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 it is getting better throughout the song, though. The it beginning is. is a little weak. Yeah. The middle is starting to get a little bit more atrocious. He's, he's warming up. He's yeah, warming yeah, up. Sounds like you're switching up, B3. I don't know. Every, every Drake song, though, <laughs> never hits you the right way the first time you hear it. Hey, yo. It, like, pause, right? <laughs> but you get what I'm saying? Like, like you'll hear it once. You'll be like, ah, Drake. I don't like this. And then after you hear it like 20 more times, you're like, yo. Yeah. <laughs> yo, you see what in. he did there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, back, to back, back to back, that shit hit, hit right away. Yeah. 
I learned the game from William West. Wesley. He said he could never test me. I said, what? what? Maestro too? Yeah. The Americans are not going to understand, understand that, that bar. Oh. We do. See, this guy put Easter eggs for us. I get more love in the city that you from, nigga. Metro, shut your whole ass up and make some drums, nigga. Oh. Oh. Rewind yeah, that. Yeah. Yo, That's the yo when I com- demons are out. When, when, I, when I commented on the on the on the post, somebody replied with the with the quote: "The Metro makes some drums." Yeah. Mm. Oh my goodness. Metro, shut your whole ass up and make some drums, nigga. Yeah, I'm a oh, six guy. I think I think it's runner. him. Y'all nigga manager was Chubb's little blunt runner. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Your little manager was Chubb's, Chubb's little, little blunt, blunt runner. runner. <sighs> This Holy. might be. If it's an AI, it's a pissed off AI. <laughs> Six and you boys ain't even come. Cash blowing, able bread out here tricking. Should we do for bitches? He doing for niggas. Ooh. Talking about cash? And yo, he talking about he didn't run from the city. <laughs> Them niggas get rich and run from the cities, man. Yeah, B3, what you think now? I'm getting cold. <laughs> <laughs> Stop Friday, it, Friday, Friday has goosebumps right now. Stop it, Friday. Yeah. Yeah. Friday's sweaty, bro. Friday's sweaty. I've never crazy. seen this guy so excited. They're going to oh, make us look no. crazy if this is a pump fake, eh? I know. I know. If this is AI, I'm going to be Yo, so don't, hurt. don't post make this. Shirts don't of us. post this if it's AI. <laughs> Yo, Real Toronto News is the first one who posted this. What is I'm, I'm kind of pissed off them potting right now. I should be on Instagram. <laughs> yeah, I know, but make these guys all jump out a closed window oh man it's not even really an yeah. open one yet i'm like dying to go look at my phone again to see what else <laughs> who else this. is posting this shit me too just wish change wicked 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 spinning like you trying to fuck while you tripping uh. Husband kisses man don't tell me about no switches i'll be rocking every fucking chain i own next visit Yo, this is not AI, bro. I know, but I don't know. He, nah. if, if it's AI, AI y'all. has gotten great. Greater than great. <laughs> and I'm trying to, if it has, is it on Champagne's page? No, this is on Rap Vivo That's right now. That's what I'm saying. Did you go on Champagne's page? On his own page? Yeah. You know what I will do? I'll do, you know, I'm going to check SoundCloud. Check SoundCloud, check Because he Spotify. does that. He has a SoundCloud? He still, he, that's where, back to back is not available on streaming platforms. Word. It's on, it's on SoundCloud, bro. And YouTube, I guess. On YouTube. <laughs> I was trying to use it for a sound the other day on YouTube, on um, Instagram. It's not available. It's not available. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I, I think I did check. Oh. Uh-oh. Is that the picture? That's the same picture. Or wasn't that's that just his picture. usual picture? Was it? Yes. Yeah, that's been his picture. And now I'm second guessing myself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they let people pump fake us out I here. I know. Though. You got me feeling crazy right now, <laughs> man. I don't know what to think. <laughs> you got yourself feeling crazy. Shout out. I'm trying to hold this, you down. If this is AI, whoever did it is a goat. Man. Goat. Yeah, because right genius. now I don't know what to do. I'm I waiting. don't know how to start the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Friday wants to go on Instagram right now. I'm, you know what? Take I'm, a I'm look. going. Yeah, I'm yeah, take, a a take a look. Shout out One Dance with over 3 billion Spotify streams. Oh, w song. Man. <laughs> I'm refreshing the page right now DJ for the listening song. audience. <laughs> pick you and know, choose. I always, pick and I choose. always, AKA I always, I always <laughs> pick and choose one Big dance. Swarma. Big shawarma in the building, yo. Yes, sir. It um, used to be young shawarma, but hey. <laughs> I, grew up, <laughs> I grew up before y'all eyes. <laughs> That's my guy. This is rap CDR. Okay, I'm not really seeing it everywhere, everywhere yet. I think it would have been. You got to wait for the academic post. Bob, that's yeah, who I'm waiting ah, for. And he's like, yeah. oh, AI. Right away, he's just like, oh. act might still be in bed. <laughs> <laughs> crying over crying over oh Chanel my goodness Glizzy. that one is wild Chi- what's that her situation name? Chai Chai Glizzy Cheyenne Chai Cheyenne Glizzy, yeah. Cheyenne Glizzy first yeah. of all her name is Glizzy at the end dog I know that is my yeah. red flag red, for red sure flag. boys red she, flag on the play all the Glizzies yeah poor act okay let's start the podcast feels like him and and we'll go back to reviewing this song <laughs> sorry what you said you don't I don't feel sorry for him I don't either yeah same you don't I don't feel sorry for you him should, either, bro. Should blaze him. Give him a real personal phone call. No, fam. I went crazy <laughs> on the on on, on the Insta, on the YouTube live. Yeah, I know you did. And I wasn't trying to go to. I wasn't trying to be disrespectful. <laughs> yeah. And he did respond to the audience or to everybody talking. Mm. Okay, he got on his live the other day and he's like, "Um, what did he say? It's better than to love and lost than to not love at all." <sighs> quote of the day is that love though i mean i've been in his i've been in his situation before you know in a toxic relationship you know what i'm saying we all have we're toxic every day but it's just when you're that 
public and visible of a person you got to watch your especially when your girl has the name glizzy in her ig <laughs> handle that's mod that should have been a giveaway boys. that's a mod thing red flag mod thing mod thing okay so mod before we start give me every i think we've discussed this before but yes. some of the crazy the, the the deepest thing that you've done while in love because or no not even the deepest thing red. the worst shit that you took because this girl has done some of the wildest things to him at this point and he's still like it's okay baby we can we can work through it what's one of the craziest things that a girl has done to you where you're like you know what i'm still gonna come back and work through it like the pussy's that fire oh, or whatever man, nah, man. That's, no 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 uh, I have a situation, but uh, is, are we sorry. going into this? Or? <laughs> sorry, I just, just if you want to, you want to be transparent I've, with the audience. I've been, I've been cheated on and then like still took it back. You know, mm -hmm. that's wild. Busy. We yeah. should cut that out. But um, <laughs> <laughs> I will say, <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, um, yo, we, we live together, so it was like a you know. Yeah, but for and that, I also almost had a kid with her, so it was kind of ah, uh, still man. Uh, it happens to the holy best of us. mind does not top that story. Should I go? Yeah. Or? The thing is, you won't know. Technically, you never know, right? I have a really bad one, but I don't want to expose. So. <laughs> expose her. Huh? You should expose, you expose Yo, listen, himself. <laughs> I, I had an ex that was also a flesh worker. Yeah. Right? A woman. A woman oh. I, allow, I allowed it. I allowed it for the first four oh, months. Oh, the man said a flesh worker. <laughs> that might I was, be the title. <laughs> wow. I allowed, it, I allowed it for the first four months. She an S you worker. Know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I allowed it for the first four months. You knowing. It. Knowing There's different energies, but I, but it was like <laughs> she was telling me, "Oh, I'm just a companion. We just talk, you know." So I was there, like, okay, giving her the better benefit of the doubt, like maybe, just maybe, she's getting paid four racks a night to just do her thing, just to hang just out, to just hang to hang out. out. Even listen to records. <laughs> it's an evening gown. Yeah. Like she wears her yeah, evening she dress, chills, to, the, to the ballet. But then, yeah, no, it wasn't the case. So we hang out and play board games. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> cool. yeah. Yeah. Three. Yeah. No, but, oh, yo, but I put my foot down after the four Don't months. And then, yeah, <laughs> and then she just went on and got the dick down. Yeah. <laughs> After that, she's a flesh worker. God damn. Oh man. I love you though for that B3. That's a good one. I hope the kids <laughs> learn from this. Don't be don't be don't, messing with these flesh Don't workers. be me, guys. No, we don't be I, me guys. I, I've been cheated on before in the past and uh, you know, I, went back. It didn't last, but see, you went back just to try it. See, yeah. see what will work. Yeah, they're scared to tell me. <laughs> they're scared to ever let me find out. Oh, Trust man. me, even if there's a, someone sleeping with my gal, they're 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 just creeping. Cause they know they get caught. You know what I mean? It's yeah. a different issue. You don't want to be caught, right? Yeah. You so know, I think inevitably you get caught. Yeah, so. inevitably. But good people are great liars. Oh, there's a time that um uh, one of my exes cheated on me, and she didn't tell me till way later on. Oh, like when she was mad. Oh my no, no, goodness. we weren't. We weren't. We weren't together no more. We kind of just like got to the other side of the tunnel, basically of the beefing and all that. And like in a moment of clarity, when we were like yeah, just yeah. having a good conversation, she's like, "Yeah, I did cheat on you." Couple times, like ah, yeah. oh my goodness! Yeah. What a chick do? on top of that. Oh, that's oh. okay. That's not that bad. That's not really. But does that not count? Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. It's just, it's it's not like, in my no, book. No, Listen, no, if you know from, you are. If they're with girls from then on, then uh, no, you it still you, wouldn't no. hurt me that, that much. Hurt that me. hurts. I, I've had that happen to me. That wouldn't hurt me that much. Girls then ended up being with a girl, and I was just like, all right, I ruined her. I felt great about that. What do you mean? I felt the best about that. <laughs> Call me toxic. I don't give a shit. I made you not ever want to suck or fuck a next toxic nigga. Toxic kings are up right now. That is the best. That is the best way to go out. Then make them go. Like Saturday I literally had another girl calling me. Like I got your girl now. I was like. So, <laughs> I was like, how my dick taste? <laughs> City you know boys? what I mean? You got a munch, you got a munch, right? She got a munch carpet and shit. You know what I'm saying? So mm. that's that's on her, right? Wait, you can't really be mad if if your girl cheats on you with another girl, girl. because that girl is giving her something that you cannot give as a man. You know, what and do you she mean? wants like no, that womanly, that womanly, that womanly affection. No, a man yeah, no, can't give a, a woman no, a no, womanly no, affection. No, pick and no, choose, just pick it and choose. You don't think so? We're stopping right there, bro. You would, you would be the same thing. It's not the same. They're doing the same shit you're doing. Nah, they can't. even worse. They can't. How can they do the same thing I'm doing if they're a girl and I'm a guy? So they, co they, have, they could eat pussy mean? better than a guy. No, they, yo, they come with a dildo. Rex yeah, yeah, that's what I'm so I, have the real dick. Like, I have the real thing. Yeah, but it doesn't stay hard as long as them. Well, it's a 
though, fam. It's, like it's not I even lose. real. And there should vibrate. It's like, you're bro, yeah. we cannot yeah. compete with losing. the technology. Imagine seeing it. Imagine <laughs> the AI. My shit don't vibrate like AI. that. Thanks again. <laughs> right? Unless it's a problem you really there. <laughs> you gotta really do that, dog. Yeah. You gotta vibrate your you're own not self. a robot, Friday. <laughs> you know uh, what I mean? How do we know? <laughs> oh. Yo, AI strikes again. La- last oh, thing on man. the toxic thing. One time, I had a shorty pick up my keyboard which i make beats on mm. and like smash it oh i've had all that ripped up but pic- pictures. she bought me another keyboard after Same day. so like, not nah, like right away though yeah like she ordered it and i was like i love you like i didn't know what to say <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh thanks for the upgrade <laughs> be, i would already be talking where you been on my life I was like, I was, it was so much emotions i went from like distraught to angry to like Oh my God! You got me another keyboard. Like it's so, it's kind of manipulative. I would be calculating was, how I'm gonna ruin her life after this. Oh man! <laughs> I seriously, I'd, I'd stick around just to ruin you. We were talking, that's, that's I think toxic. we all got different levels of toxicity. That's, that's, that's like max level, <laughs> max maximum level. level, boss level. <laughs> yeah, final, final boss, final, final boss, boss level. level. I'm gonna stick it out just to. <laughs> the final toxic boss, bro. Right? You think you can play me and get away with it? <laughs> oh man. Oh, I'm, <laughs> Dusty, Dusty's ready to crash out, eh? <laughs> no, I don't crash out. I just I play the game. Okay. You know what I mean? Gotta really? play the game. Well, let's get this podcast started, man. Let's get some shit. This is not AI. Jesus Christ. I love that song. <laughs> yeah, Yo, that, muscle dance, that, there? that dance, that dance, that dance you're doing is literally the dance that makes you want to do <laughs> I almost got a muscle spasm. Holy. Getting old in here. Let's get this shit started. So we are It's the Rose Most Smoked Out Podcast. We love hip hop. I'm your host with the most toast, Friday Ricky Tread, aka Ready for War Rick. Um, part three, I guess, or part two. Um, aka bunch of AKAs. We back at it again. B3 Studios, episode 462. Um, we got Dusty Wallace in this mother. What up? What up? <laughs> yeah, what up? What up? We got some business to stand on today, so I'm, I'm here to work. <laughs> I'm here to work. Let's get to work, guys. I know, I know, I know. Keep me busy. Um, and also, we got DJ Zara in the motherfucking building. Yes, sir. DJ Zara, a.k.a. Young Shawarma Turn, Big Shawarma Turn, Beast from the Middle East. You know what I'm saying? A.k.a. Stash McGee. You know what I'm saying? Got the muzzy. <laughs> What's good, boys? <laughs> <laughs> got the muzzy. Got the muzzy. Got the muzzy. And also, we got B3 in the motherfucking Building. Big B Thrizzle in the Kizzle. What's good, man? That's good, guys. Yeah, man. So we back at it. Like I said, episode 462. Um, you know, Cubicle Gang Gang. Uh, subscribe, like, all that good stuff for the people on YouTube. Before we get into it, also, big salute to the sponsors. Big salute to Diamond Club. They got delivery all over the GTA if you need that loud. Also, they got edibles, pens, anything that you need. Hit them up on their Instagram page, Diamond Club underscore Canada. And use the code We Love Hip Hop if you want a little discount. You heard me? Yeah, man. Also, um, if you need that blem, hit up steaming hot grabber they got the best grabber in town okay um red herring grabber red rose all types of good stuff hit them up on their instagram page steaming hot grabber and you could also use the code we love hip-hop and get yourself a little discount um quick fast announcements the junk show is going down this weekend okay Mm -hmm. be there or be square april 18th is going to be down there in um toronto and the 19th show is going to be over in uh Niagara, if I'm not mistaken. And then the twentieth is in Hamilton. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Uh the We Love Hip Hop Gang is gonna be opening up. Big salute to junk. We got free tickets that we're giving away over here. Um, jump in the comments if you want to get some free tickets. You don't even have to do nothing crazy. Just, Just say like, yo. I want a ticket, fam. <laughs> Swing yeah. me one. You know what I'm saying? And we'll and, send it. And we'll, we'll we'll make sure that you get some tickets at the door for any of the uh, any of the three shows. You know That's what I'm saying? Uh, what's this over here again? That's uh, for is that? that's the uh, VIP to oh, meet yes. and greet for drunk. Yes, and there's a meet, there's a VIP one also over here too. Okay, so jump in those comments. Let us know if you want to go down to the junk show. And this is for April 18th. You get two free tickets and a VIP. Yeah, and anywhere, anywhere like it. They oh, can, anywhere? Yeah, they can be in Hamilton with this, or okay. they can be in Niagara with this, or Toronto. Right. So, so what Dusty said. Yeah. This is good for any spot. And we'll email it to you, so it's not ne- necessarily like you have to come and get it physically from me. Yeah, I could actually get an email to you. Exactly. Or so they right. could just pick them up when you get to the show type shit. You know what I'm saying? That too. Um, 
I think we're we're good. We don't need to do any formalities. I think everybody's in good health and wealth and all that. Yeah, you know man. What I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Of all course. right. Of course, we would let you know when we're pissed off. A um, couple of things also before we get to the beast and all that. Some RIPs. All right. RIP OJ the Juice Man Simpson. You know what I'm saying? Fuck. Yeah. Thoughts before shit. we get into that. I'm not black. OJ. <laughs> OJ. <laughs> y'all are a little bit younger. Y'all don't you y'all are so too young I, for the I know, about, I know about the OJ I situation. Caitlyn okay. Jenner tweet. That tweet is ruthless, man. She said good riddance. She said good riddance. Hashtag good riddance. OJ Simpson. Yeah, but you know what? That's wow. uh but that's uh Chloe's dad, eh? Yeah. Don't ever forget that. Apparently. That's speculative yeah, yeah, yeah. still. <laughs> she looks like him. That jawline is all OJ. They've been saying that for years. Years. So what? I, I, none of us have known OJ in any type of capacity, but like, you know, is it, you know, is it a RIP or is it good riddance? It's still, it's, R- it's still well, RP, RIP. Yeah. Oh, the man was a Buffalo Bills, bro, for years. And you know what I mean? Like, I grew up watching him play football. And technically, he was never found guilty. I know. Because, Not in the criminal case. No, because because what's her name? Nicole owed so much money for dope. So mm. whoever she owed money to was trying to extort him first. And then and then she was going around telling people he beats her up and da 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 da. So perfect angle. You owe me a million dollars worth. Of, I'm going to come kill you and your boyfriend. <laughs> Pause. Unlive you. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. And, and then uh, drop a glove that didn't fit. OJ, if on the, the glove don't fit, then you must acquit. Exactly. <laughs> I think he definitely did. You think he did it? Yeah, he definitely every, every, did those murders. I'm, I'm, like, nah, man. He didn't do it. I think he did. He didn't do it. <laughs> um, and he lost in the civil case. He did. He did. Like, yeah. he had, if the glove doesn't fit, you must acquit. And, like, I don't know, like, I'm not, I'm not trying to, like, alter his legacy or anything because I think his football career and who he was as a star speaks for itself. But I'm not going to ignore the fact that, like, he – on a live two people like don't feel bad fam because his legacy is not really his football anymore no like his legacy is what that. is criminal and he <laughs> got caught up with robberies after too even after his own stuff yeah like but merch. what are you seeing like i don't know like yo because that's what they do to a lot of um american blacks to tell you the truth i'm i'm gonna be real like they build you up and then they break you down right so it's up to you to like keep yourself together as any type of athlete or actor or or musician, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, don't kill your bitch. I yeah. think there is a cons- <laughs> well, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, try not to do that one. Yeah, uh, but is it that girl was a uh, word Nicole, Nicole was uh she was out there doing a lot of freaky stuff. Oh yeah. She yeah. was having she was having freak ups. Yeah, but you know, for the people who do believe like Loki, I kind of believe that he did on a live or still. Yeah. But and the like, man too, Ron and Goldman, right? Yes, yeah. Ron Goldman, RIP to him as well. But mm-hmm. like at the time, I kind of didn't care. I was like W for the black man because it was right around the, the Rodney King times, yeah, <laughs> all that shit. Like we were catching so many L's yeah. and like major L's like Rodney King's got beat down for like nothing for nothing, basically. Right. So it was like and they started a riot out in that bitch. And we were in high school. Like I, I yeah. was in high school those yeah, times. Was right. Elementary. Mm-hmm. And it was like a black versus white type of thing. Them times when when OJ won, like white people were mad and black people were happy. Now, in hindsight, over the years, it was because at the time we were like, at the time we thought he was innocent. At least I did. Over the years, the way he showed his, his ass, you know, with books like, if I did do it and all yeah. kind of stupid shit. I was like, bro, you might have done it, fam. You wildin'. You know what I'm saying? I do think there's a concerted effort to, like, bring down certain black celebrities. But I also think some of them, like, do just do genuinely themselves. mess up. Yeah. You know what I'm they saying? They do it themselves. They do it to themselves. And then too. maybe the media side of it makes it even 10 times worse. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. I'm sure the media machine has info on everyone. Yeah. Like, they have blackmail info on every. They, they know, yeah, yeah. like, you know, they have access to your information. Um, but, yeah, in, in the case of OJ, like, I don't know, just based on what I've seen, I wasn't there. I don't even know how old I was at the time. But uh, I, I believe that he did it. Yeah, well, listen, RIP to OJ, okay? You know, just to give a quick blurb on the OJ thing. Yeah. Also, um, I, we got a lot of topics, so I'm going to be mm. trying to speed through a couple of them. Yes. Keith Lee. What are y'all yep. thoughts on Keith Lee? He's been here in Toronto. I think he's probably gone by now, or is he going to be here for two weeks? He can't stay here that long with all that shitty food reviews he's doing. So you don't like the food? that the Man, he, went to, he went to, I'm a chef. You know that. This guy went to like, yo. He went to the wrong spot. He went to the wrong spot. Now he went to some good spots, bro. He went, he went to the wrong spot. Didn't he get? Didn't Not he get to a, diss Nasu uh, and the Bohemian food and all that. <laughs> but honestly, he could have went to uh, Jamaica House. 
out in Brampton. You know what I'm saying? Mm. You're going to Scarborough. Scarborough's not known for Jamaican food. Hey, yo, yeah, yeah, Sorry, yeah. Bro. Scarborough has a lot of didn't, food, though. Didn't he it try don't Jamaican have good food. food. It, it has haka spots, bro. Pure haka. He should have <laughs> went out there and ate some haka and some blood clot Chinese food. No, he got some shawarma in Scarbs. Oh, even that, he should have. Even that, he's still in the wrong spot for that. I don't oh, know. Scarbs no. has probably the best shawarma. Maybe us or Mississauga. I would have went to Saga now. Yeah. If I'm going to go get shawarma, you're going to go get some Jamaican food. You got to stay in the West End. He fully ate the fish. The whole snapper fish, like with the bone in it, yeah, idiot that. guy. And then he's like, "Oh, there's bones." Off. He's like, "There's cut bones in it." Dr- yeah, like cut those flipping. No, 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 nuts no, no! Off. Don't do that to him, man. No, no, I, like that I, I, I like Keith Can't Lee. come around here, bro, and come ridicule Toronto. Toronto. We have the best food in the world. He's not ridiculous. Some, yeah, he is. He he didn't go to the right spots. He just didn't go to any stapled spots that yeah. people are like, "Yo, he went there a lie." Like he's like no. At least he avoided sun, um, sunrise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did true. one good thing. True. But no, listen, I'm, I don't know, right? I'm he, not really he, up on all of the places. Like, look at this one. He, that's an Ajax. This is pretty dope. Oh, Toronto, Ontario, Canada. This that's is the Ajax. most Canadian thing I've ever done. I never knew this I was got really, it. Uh, Let's existed. try it and rate it one to ten. We spent thirty six dollars and sixty. He annoys me. Ninety nine percent of the time, I always decline backyard <laughs> in house or like plates because I don't want nobody house getting super busy. There's no guarantee that's gonna get busy, but there's a possibility. But this is completely different. This is he annoys me. Does he? Blink? This place. Here's a hidden gem that you That's can find thing, in bro. someone's backyard. Does he blink? Backyard. That looks Google good, Google though. Google though. TikTok sauce. It's vegan? You'll know you're in the right place know. when you see these signs. I think it's so vegan. So if you keep walking all the way I'm down the vegan. driveway, you'll come across this shed. What you'll find inside is biscuits. That That's crazy to me. Espresso bar. The shelves were stacked with snacks and chocolates. They have baked... Like, just for, like, the snack and the chocolate guys, like, not the food food, the food. That's cool. That... Like that to have like a little shed in and then when you go in there, it's like a full out like bakery. Yeah. Like that's sick. You know what I'm saying? I never, it took Keith Lee to come here to make me realize that like existed. That. Yeah, yeah. So that's a good look. You know what I'm saying? Uh, he put on bro. Like what's this right hand. here? The the pottery taste test. Yeah. What is pottery? Yeah, in Texas and this small woman owned business has been reaching out to us. For yeah, weeks. that's in Texas. No? I mean, 13 plus. Oh, he's in Texas now? Yeah, he, he went oh, to he Houston. out of here. He went to Houston already. He's gone. <laughs> there he got we're, gonna, we're gonna harass him. Oh man! So this is this is good because as a Toronto man, yeah, your, your first reaction is nah. No. Okay, you're saying as another Toronto man, you weren't mad at some of his selections. So no. like we have what? a fifty fifty right now. Damn, he could have went to Kensington, went to uh, Rasta Pasta. There was a lot you, of people yeah, saying yeah. that he could have went so many. And then if you were gonna eat some Mexican food, he goes. You gotta go to the spots like Saint Clair where there's Mexican restaurants and the te- and you know what I mean. Like yeah, yeah, he yeah, didn't yeah, yeah. do the real um, culture side to us. We're very multicultural. He just went one way and it was shitty. No, he tried different cultural foods, yeah. but maybe not the best from each culture yeah, in, available. But the Keith Lee effect is real, and like all these yeah. restaurants. Yeah after his reviews get flooded with business. So yeah. I think it's good that he's highlighted a couple restaurants in oh, each area, like in Scarborough. So what he's helping is the little moms and pop shops. In That's all he does. Well, Sahan, he does. Sahan is already big. Sumuk Barbecue is already big. Like yeah. Everyone already knows yeah. him, but yeah. it, it gives him a little bit of credibility and he's yeah. kind of doing them a favor. And like, I think it's cool that at least he came to Scarborough, nah. you know? Nah, he could have went to like Liberty Village. He could have went everywhere. Scarborough's up. I, I love Scarborough guys. Don't get it. Don't get it twisted. Oh my goodness. Fast. Watch it. <laughs> I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. I'm gonna stay straight up. They well, do honorary not. Scarborough man now. I know <laughs> honorary Scarborough man. I don't care. <laughs> Nothing beats the West End when it comes to the food. To the food game. Nothing. We should How many do. Times we should do a video like, like the West End. We should do a video he, he like went, that. He went to a, a spot called Old Nassau. Nassau. That's Nassau. down the Nassau. street Nassau. from. Yeah, Nassau. Yo, fam. That's on Western. Yeah. Honestly, let's be real. It's cool and all. But it wasn't where he should have went. <laughs> wah, wah, Plus, he just pissing off your business owners ah, today. Shit. Yo, wasn't one of the restaurants that he went to like? I'll go of, in there myself tomorrow and be like, "Hey, the, the cashier was hungover or something." I I heard some stuff where yeah, it was like, yeah, "Yeah, like he got like a negative review, like," and then the owner apologized. The jerk, the jerk place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah, went yeah. to the shittiest jerk place you could ever eat jerk from. Oh no! And <laughs> I think it was Scarborough, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, you know no. what I mean? Okay, well, so look, let's he do this. Scarborough people look bad. We like. Let's do this. Let's yeah. do this for the audience, okay? Yeah. Because I don't want to stand and keep Lee talking I'm too long. We got him. we got real shit to get. I know, into. but I'm mad at him. Um, let us know in the uh, in the comments. Yeah. Which ends has the best food? Best Caribbean food. Let's do that. West. Okay. Oh, East Caribbean end. food. Oh, oh, both Caribbean food and 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 uh, food in general. 
No, let's no, go. No, no, no. We got Arab, Arab food. Arab food. Middle Arab Eastern, food, yeah. Middle Eastern food, mm-hmm. and, and Caribbean food. Which ends has the best? West End or the East End? Mm-hmm. Okay, mm-hmm. Common Gang Strong. I yep. need to see the, I need to see the, the results. And, and, and you should even say halal spots. Mm. Let's go shawarma gang in the comments. Let's <laughs> get it. Let's get it running for the east, boys. <laughs> I'm telling you, the shawarma gang is gonna come through, and it's gonna be saga, pure saga, mm. pure saga, and Eglinton, uh, like West. I don't there's know. A, Scarborough some, has some good spots. Man. They do. They and do. They do. The West End has some great spots too, though. West so End, no for it, food, bro. It definitely, it's definitely a, a battle of the titans. You know what I'm saying? I've mm-hmm. never been in my head like, yeah, let's go to Scarborough and eat. Oh, chill. Never. I've never been like, let's go to the West End. Yeah, because you guys can't. Actually, I, I, <laughs> I've done that a couple times. I've done it a couple times. <laughs> yeah, you, see, you, see, <laughs> you see? There's actually a couple spots that, that you are go. only in the West. You yeah. know? Thank you. Thank you. We'll salute to Keith Lee, man. Thanks. Yeah, but he should have went to Kensington. He would have had a ball out there. Yeah. I love well, Kensington. He, and next time you come back, bro, pull up, man. Let's yeah, do an no. interview. Fam. I'll take you to the real spots, bro. Yeah. Um, But there's um, <laughs> what we were playing in the beginning. Big salute to the sponsors, Diamond Club, with delivery all over the GTA and now all across Canada. They got the best selection of flour, edibles, and pens, and all types of goodies that you need. You can find them on their Instagram page, Diamond Club underscore Canada, or you can find them on the 7 Days of Weed app as well as the Leafy Things app. Let them know that you heard about them through the We Love Hip Hop Network, and they may give you a discount. Big salute to Diamond Club. Cheer! Okay. Yeah. Let's let's circle back over to this Drake conversation because Future just dropped Future and Metro Boomin. We don't trust you too. We still don't we trust still you. Don't trust we you. still don't trust you. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, my bad. My bad. We you. still don't trust you. Yeah. <laughs> Which is a crazy title. I know. Um, yeah, me not trusting Drake today. <laughs> well, this is the, this is might be Drake's response to what happened this this over the last couple of days. Now on that album, did you guys get a chance to like at least skim through the album? Yeah, I did. Bit? Yeah, right? yeah, Red Leather. Red Leather is the song there with with a uh, J Cole. 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 There's a few other songs that you know have some other features, but it's not a war album. It's like more of a lovers album. This is more of like a it's chill, the, go chill with your girl kind of album. I think the, some of the beats are are the reason why, because a lot of the, some of the beats are more popular. Yeah, and more like it's very musical, eighties yes. vibe. It's giving a like a old school eighties 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 for real. And you know we're all ready for like, okay, is Kendrick gonna come? Where's Pusha? Who's gonna drop? Like they came with the weekend had some bars for Drake. Mm-hmm. The J Cole song. It wasn't no bars for Drake on that, but it was kind of like, bro, what happened? You just apologized to Kendrick, and now you're on the same album as the Ops. And then there's one more person who took a shot, uh, ASAP Rocky. Yeah. That was a big one. You think so? <sighs> yes. Yeah. I think he reaching. I he even reaching. Even though as DJ pick and choose, I've always considered myself an ASAP Rocky. Mm-hmm. Uh, I wouldn't say fan, but like I like his music. Mm. Um, and I think it was very opportunistic of him to kind of like join, join the forces against Drake, the Revengers. Like for for his perspective, he's been quiet for a while, and he's like, okay, what's a better time to like come back into hip hop than now. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And especially if he has dirt on him, you know what I'm saying? Still not running <laughs> that track though. Shout out Drake. Um, <laughs> but yeah, the ASAP Rocky verse was like, it was significant. Well, I'll play a little bit of it. I have a snippet of it on my, uh, on the We Love Hip Hop Instagram page. Follow We Love Hip Hop Network. Put me on the first one. Make it sweet. First son. Black go hit it first <laughs> So that's the the bar that he had for Drake on that on that song. I gotta be honest, wah, wah, right? wah. and with all due respect to what you just said, uh, DJ Zar, mm-hmm. I'm not feeling that right there, bro. Dog shit. You 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 brought a knife to a bazooka fight, bro. <laughs> like, fam, if that's the if that's the level of artist that you need <laughs> to bring to to get at Drake, bro, like fam. now the bar is going down. They need mm-hmm. to call like, God right now. If they want to yeah. beat Drake. No, but fam, you went from Kendrick, this high level lyricist, going crazy, sending all these bars at Drake, to where's one? Uh, 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 where's Yo, my fashion? Uh, you can tell uh, Rihanna has a has a grip on his mouth. Yeah. Rihanna runs his household her her household. Even Rihanna's looking at the at They're the like, studio hey, bars at the bars at the studio hey, session. Hey, like, boy. Oh, See that, wrong with this that boy. verse gave her the ick, eh? It's like yeah. skin boy going. Gracio. <laughs> yeah. 
Like now and the, he hit it first. <laughs> yeah, Drake hit it first. Drake no? hit it first. You hit it last, baby. Oh, we f each other. <laughs> <laughs> we all f each other. <laughs> we have to put translations there on the bottom for that. <laughs> right? But like, I, I don't know. It's just not enough. And the weekend yeah. did have some things to say. Yeah. I don't have the snippet from what the weekend said. So but he like said he, about Baka. He went, oh, I, yeah, I, I hope the TikToks. I hope Baka. I hope Baka earned. So everybody your label do, do TikTok. <laughs> that kind of went ba- made ba- Baka go viral because I we're know. seeing him pop up like on talking, all these pages doing the, the TikToks <laughs> and shit. <laughs> and being like, one time this girl. Is like, that supposed to be a bad look? Like, is yeah, your yeah. shooter not supposed to have TikTok? No. That's a good quote. Co- please, mm-hmm. please, thank you. Our shooter's not allowed to have TikToks. It, it, it also <laughs> does. It also doesn't Shooter's help when you're sensitive size. when the the screenshot of your TikToks. If Come. you look, all the TikToks are all like maybe eight thousand views. Less than mm. less than ten. So is that views. why it's an issue? Because he's not booming on TikTok. Is like it's one it, thing to make no. TikToks, but like make TikToks and you don't have that many followers. Yeah, but like even if you're if you're a shooter, okay, and let's take it away from Baka for a quick second because I don't want to offend <laughs> nobody. But like if you're like, because I don't think Baka's a sh- Baka's not out there shooting man it's for Drake, bro. No, <laughs> <dollar> man, no. <laughs> like it just sounds cool to say, okay, yeah, he's yeah, not yeah. his shooter, right? But if a real shooter. Had a TikTok and every once in a while he's like, da da da, sturdy, sturdy, sturdy. Flowers in his head, <laughs> yeah. with a, with doing a, the dances with a pink strap. But I'll, you know he takes it there. Like he yeah. he he has bodies. Like is that that's not fine? We can't do that. Yeah, you could. He's it. not masculine enough in himself that like I got bodies, bro. Like <laughs> leave me alone, fam. Let me do my dance. Yeah. Let me do the freaking broom challenge. <laughs> yeah, let me live life. Yeah, is that okay? It's okay, but it's not cool. I might test, you know. <laughs> it's deceiving. Test. I thought you were a shooter, dog. Like you're out here making just, TikToks. I, I think mean, it's just ammunition for somebody else, really, to to, to this. I mean, but if you're a real shooter, him. if you're a real shooter, you don't care what anyone thinks. Like, bro, like True. you're ready to freaking ride. If you're like, yeah, I want to make TikToks. Like, you're not gonna stop me from making TikToks. True. I feel like that's what I feel like doing. <laughs> I want to partake in that trend, <laughs> right? <laughs> and I'll still shoot you. So. Yeah, bad, bad men can make TikToks. Yeah, I, but should they is the question. <laughs> but should they? <laughs> How long are you gonna be a bad man for though? I don't know. I'm completely no, outside looking in on this man. one. No, no, you no, have no, to no. Be a bad man today. You're still or, actively like you, you pop somebody last week. Oh god! And now there's a new trend on TikTok, and you're like, I would like to partake, fam. That, that's that's where they catch most of you guys. It's not TikTok, <laughs> idiot. Sorry, I don't man. think we should. I don't. I, I'm gonna go with no, no. If you're a real shooter, like you got bodies and all that, and there's a new dance trend going on, you might just have to watch from the sidelines. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But yo, he's just also like, <laughs> isn't he technically an artist? Now, yeah. This is what I'm saying. Baka's not a shooter. <laughs> so, yes, let the man do the damn TikToks. People right. are putting this on the man, like as if he's taking bodies down for I, Drake, bro. I think, he, I think he's about to start acting. Who, Baka? Yep. Why I, not? I, I Why fuck not? around and see him in a couple of those little, little small shows. You know what I'm saying? That'd Let the cool. man express himself, fam. Yeah. Get you know into acting, Baka. You seem like you'd be a good villain. See what the problem is? This is the problem with, our, with, with this hip-hop game. Yeah. They want us to be so toxic yep. that man who spent 11 years in jail, he's enjoying his life. 13, 13. 13 years in jail. He's now home. He's rich. He's with the boy. He's doing TikToks. He's clearly happy. Uh, <laughs> your shooters are doing TikTok. So what? Is he supposed to drop the phone now and come start shooting his gun, bro? Like, no, fam. He's living his life. Allow him. Well, you know what I was really surprised with? How small that apartment was. Which one? Where he's doing the TikToks out of. Sorry, not to like this, Baka. I'm Yo, just saying. I didn't, even, awesome. I didn't even realize the real estate situation. Yeah, see, I'm, you got everybody's watching the, the the. I was watching the aesthetics. I'm like, Yo, this nigga should have a penthouse. What's going on, dog? <laughs> he didn't, That's like, clearly Dusty Wallace's same, voice, not mine. <laughs> for the listening. Same buddy. <laughs> buddy has a little disclaimer. But he's gonna be like, you know, Dusty, I real nigga because I'm, I'm not looking at him doing the TikToks. I'm like, Yo, when you're doing these TikToks, you're just sitting on. on I'm thinking it's an Airbnb, like or something. I don't know <laughs> nah. if it's really his place. I don't know, like, is He's it moving your, around, bro? Yeah, like, is that your place? <laughs> that, like, yo, yo, I started thinking realer, like, yo, he's probably just there, just you know, with a gal, just she can't know where he really lives. So he mm. burned. <laughs> That's how I'm thinking now. I'm like, let's get, who's holding the camera? He could have a little one bedroom <laughs> in Fort York. We don't know. But one thing with this That's whole still thing, a right? Dollars, yeah, yeah, it's still yeah. expensive. It's still yeah. smallish, but no, yeah, they're super small. Yeah, this is Toronto living, fam. It's expensive. Mm. Then I would just go bunk up with Drake. You, who says that the boy wants company like bro, that, bro? That big ass house with a basketball court and da, 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 da. nigga, nah, it's there. all mine, fam. I you want, I want every room. <laughs> yeah, that too. Nigga might be like, 
uh, can I come stay at you? Uh, kind of, all the rooms are kind of full right How? now. <laughs> but like, who's there? Trubs? TV? What's going on here, guys? <laughs> who's there for? Basketball teams? How yeah, is that like, full? How is that full? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, he probably has one room for them. Like, it's just a direct apartment. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Has an upstairs, everything, that kitchen. You wouldn't even know the man's them right there. You guys are putting so much pressure on the boy. <laughs> yeah, bro. You got to deal with the man them properly. Gotta, he's got to put man's up in the crib now yeah. and everything too, bro. Yeah, like, bro. If you're not giving them record yo, deals. Friday, I remember I, I was watching your live stream and you were saying how like Drake has a certain amount of hours to respond. Yeah. Do you still feel that way? Well, that's the thing. We In the beginning of the pod, we were listening to this new Drake song. Alleged, you, alleged you Drake song. You alleged his, Drake song. Get his internetly beat up. <laughs> well, that's the thing. We're, <laughs> we we're don't so know. not sure because we're in real time right now. And obviously, like people see this on a Monday and everything. For all we know, by the time that time comes, it, is, it was an official track or uh -huh, you know what I'm saying? We trolled you, right? So we're super apprehensive right now to say, yes, this is the song. These are the bars that we need to analyze because it might not, it might be AI. But from what I'm hearing so far, it's good AI. <laughs> Remember when I asked you the other day, would you take an AI record from a certain person if they're either gone or-, or I know he don't think it's AI. I think I think I think this is the response. I, yo, I, I believe I'm gonna that go on too. a limb. Seeing is believing. Right? I, I like we're in real time right now where I'm gonna check my phone again and see how much other people have been posting this because more than one real Toronto news is the first one we've seen so far. Fan. Right? Fan. If by the end of the day it's flooded all over the timeline, it's real, fam. Fam, I'm almost they're pump faking us so bad that people actually post it just so they you can post it before them. That's mm. how I feel yeah, like Toronto let Raps, me post this before Toronto <laughs> Rap Stars. Friday, no, they like, posted it, eh? Everybody Toronto jumped out the window. Just now. Toronto Rap Stars. 15, That's still not confident. Fifteen like, minutes ago. That if Drake, the boy doesn't post it, it's not real. That's very true, though. What Dusty's saying is very, not very true. real, guys. Like, if the man doesn't post it himself, it's kind of hard to just say, like, okay. this is him. What time is it right now? He wakes up every day at 2. How do you know this? 2.45. And how, do, how do you know that, Don't Dusty? Worry, I know a certain thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right? <laughs> if we see it drop by 6 o'clock and it says, our time, <laughs> then it's on, like, Donkey Kong. He has three Kong. hours, then. Yes, okay. hours. Do me a favor, B3. Because, um, like, we're... In this weird, um, what would you call this? Like a purgatory of how do we analyze this? Like <laughs> where do we real? go from here? Yeah. Right? Because we have a response, but we're not sure if it's real. Thank you. Go on some other OVO members' pages, like Ch no, no, Chubbs. No. Maybe check OVO that. Nico. You would have seen it. It would already right? have popped up on your in your in your in, on your algorithm. Sorry. And one thing I did see is um, the guys who run the page for this OVO Sound Radio, they said something about same time, same place. So I guess they might be doing a show tonight. You know what I'm saying? But I'll play. Um, you know, I'm looking through them right now. Has nope. anybody has anybody posted it? Thank you. Nope. Right, like that's the thing. When Drake drops, and and Dusty's making a great point. When Drake team. drops, the whole team will be dropping it. They even change their freaking um, the Instagram pictures. profile Thank pics, yeah. all types Thank of stuff. You. you know what I'm saying? It's time. Right now, this might be a different tactic. Maybe this is a tactic where they're like, we'll just let it let everybody else start speculating. No. But it'll be very different no, than no, what no, they usually do. Because no, no, no. we've seen Drake in war before. Yeah, mm -hmm. but this time, what are they doing? Just sending in like a dud missile? Now, I think so. I think they might be throwing like a little like a little bone at everyone. Mm -hmm. And then like everyone's going to run to that. Then they're going to drop like the napalm. You know what I'm saying? Like, or, yeah. or they're going to make Kendrick now come out, drop some some mid shit, too. And we're going to be like, ah, this was whacked by Kendrick, y'all. Well, that's after, the thing. Boom, Drake, come and kill you again. We're still or not even us. They, you know, and this is just I'll give you a little bit more insider from what I've heard about strategy, at least. Kendrick never really dropped. He no. dropped on the future song. Dropped a it. verse, yeah. He dropped a verse, and on the verse, he had some bars, mm -hmm. right? But that's not for Drake to have a full song responding to a verse on somebody else's tune. That's not enough. Like, drop your tune, and then now we'll show our hat. You know what I'm saying? That was a whole bunch of AI rapping, I feel, on that record. Well, that's the thing. If this is the real record, let's say, right? Or one of the real records. Because, you know, I told y'all I got a little yeah. piece of yeah. insider saying he has two. There's more than one song ready. Mm. So let's say now 
this is the the feeler or pause or the you know the the warning shot. Kendrick comes out now. This is my song. This is my response to the things that you've been saying because he's had a lot of smoke for Kendrick on what we were just hearing just now. Mm. He had a lot of bars for Kendrick. Yeah, but yo, didn't you mention last time that in terms of the difference between the warning shot and the actual shot, mm. they've been giving warning shots. It, it hasn't been like a. It's been years. Yeah, they've been going at it, right? So Kendrick came out with the shot and then for yeah. them to drop another warning on top of everybody already knows they're beefing and it's made been made public right so for him to drop a warning now it doesn't make sense no 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 we got to correct that because they weren't dropping warning shots all this time they've been w- dropping subs at each other mm, okay they've never been as direct as what we heard when kung fu kenny dropped the other day and mm. like those shots are cl- since control right control was the last time he had, he said names on control Right. And that was super direct. But all these other times over the like the last 10 years, I guess now, there's been like that could be interpreted as Kendrick. That could be interpreted as Drake. Like when you, you know, decipher the bar. These last ones, this last track it was clearly going at Drake and Cole. You know what I'm saying? So now we that's the warning shot. You know what I'm saying? Um, like that track to me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Do you think the way J. Cole handled his Kendrick situation permanently affects his legacy? Yes. Wow. Actually, yes. He's always going to have, like, fam, that's never been done in hip-hop before. A guy dropping a song and then pulling it back and saying, uh, I apologize for the song. Like, I hated it. Yeah, I hate it. It was corny. Bro, you'll be on bro. tour with, with uh, TDE members. You don't do that, bro. That's probably why he felt You're that guilt. on tour eh? with TDE members, bro. Yeah. That's real discomforting. Like, come on, man. Yeah, but they're not. Remember, Kendrick's not on TDE anymore. He's got his own label now, matter. PG there's, Lang. Yeah, but they're all friends. They're all still gang. You know what I mean? It's not like he's a disgruntled employee that used to be there or something. I don't know. You would already thing. heard it. We've already heard. I've heard inklings. Oh, that it wasn't, he was like, that wasn't, it wasn't the best relationship. They might have not been overtly or outwardly like TDE whoa, type whoa, shit. Whoa. But like, mm. you know, I've heard that there wasn't it wasn't the best relationship at some yeah. points in time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. TDE artists have complained on the release times and different things over the years. I've seen Absol complain. I've seen SZA complain. Like, Holy you know what I mean? Like, let, let me drop. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So it's not always like fun and games over there at at, at Top Dog Entertainment, bro. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So the thing is with this whole shit now, like the best diss on the whole album is coming from a singing nigga. Really, when you take it in, like mm-hmm. in my opinion, like the best diss was on from The, the weekend. weekend. The Weekend, yeah. Like we're not going to say Rocky had the best diss. So it's, come on, fam. Like this is not, there's nothing to respond to on this. Mm-hmm. On this new future shit. This is not something where it's like, oh, we still don't we still don't trust you. And then they came with a whole bunch of extra oh shit. Oh my god. No, nah, fam. Like they got J. Cole to switch sides <laughs> and and rap about girls. They got Rocky, who's not that great of a not the best rapper. He's a swag guy. Yeah, he's a swag rapper. You know what I'm saying? And a fashionist. You, and then you got a singing guy to come and sing some bars against Baca. <laughs> Come on, fam. Like, it, are we really, really like? If I'm Drake and I'm sitting there taking in what people are bringing to me, I'm not stressed, fam. Yeah, I'd be like, the weekend. This is all you got. <laughs> That's it. You should have a third one on the way. Please, <laughs> please have a. We still, still don't trust you because yeah, and then pushes on that one or something yeah, like. Because yeah, this is not enough, fam. I'm not scared. He had that cool. IG story where it was like the guy digging for diamonds. Yes, and it was like almost there. So he's pretty much saying like they didn't have a hit. Like they're almost there. You know. Yeah. Um. So I I don't know who Drake should primarily. Do you think he should primarily address Metro and and Kendrick, Metro and Future, Future Kendrick? All of them. I, yeah, fire blaze. And now he has to have him with ASAP men- uh, mentioning oh, ASAP. Man, he's gonna tear yeah. him. Yo, this <laughs> was this was like civil war, but it turned into world war. Thanos versus everybody. You know, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, literally. And they're also, trying to take it down. They're take starting down. to show like everybody who Drake. Like, like I did a post, and a whole bunch of other people were doing posts on the stimulus package. Like when ASAP Rocky, hey, the first person who ever put me on was Drake. You know, future the big tour, yeah, yeah. Drake, all these guys. 
Drake's been blessing them. The Migos, all these different people for years, Drake has been blessing them with number one hits. Yeah, it touches your Changes remix. their lives. Yes. Changes their pockets. Changes the future outcome of their entire career. Yes. 21, first hit. J. Cole, first number one with Drake. Yeah, I think it's crazy that there's footage of each and each of each and every one of them saying how Drake changed their lives. Yes. So for all of these guys to switch crazy. sides, bro, like I, walk one, bro. If I was Drake, I would just send them a big fat receipt. Yeah. Yeah, you, all you niggas owe me money. Like an invoice? I, yeah. I real one too, eh, for the rest of their life, locked in like some Suge Knight thing. Let me garnish your wages, fam. Yeah, yeah, like what the hell, lights. fam? Or he buys out their whole catalog and then Like on some Michael Jackson shit. On some Michael Jackson shit. Oh, I hope he does. Buys out their entire catalog. I, I own your music now. Yeah. That's the petty I like. And, and, then, and, then, and then shelves it. And yeah. Mm-hmm. That's an expensive level oh, You can't level drop music no more. You know what he says? He puts it on the USB and throws it in the safe? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, because MJ MJ did that. To, <laughs> That's what he's gonna do. Just bash it out of USB. And MJ did that to Eminem. No, no, he did it to the Beatles. To the Beatles, but then he bought the Eminem shit too. Did he buy? Uh, he might. Be- he bought the Beatles too. Yeah, and Eminem stuff. Too, he might have bought Eminem. Bought M&M. Yeah, and then Eminem. He was like, right, I, bet. I bought him. Yep, the whole catalog. Yep. I I don't know if it was the whole catalog, but he, he just that song. Like I guess one or yeah, two but songs that's Clive Davis's guy. Like you don't you don't play with yeah, Michael yeah, yeah. Clive. Mm-hmm. Um, I want to before we close out the segment here. Can we play a little bit of this again, man? I don't know. Man. It's a four minute tune. Play, play, Is it real? Yeah, Started from the second half. You know what? I'm gonna do another search. I'll do I, can't, I can't. I can't. I uh, can't condone. <laughs> Capri. I'm gonna do another search and see who else has posted this now. Because right now, the one that we were listening to earlier, that's from Rap Vivo. See what I'm saying? Which I don't know what Rap Vivo is. They have about 56 subscribers, though. Yeah, so. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Like, if it's not <laughs> coming from flipping, don't. Oh, my God. They Wait, just... Ak is live right now. Oh, let's get it. Let's, let's see what he's saying. saying. Oh, breaking news. So perhaps the best way to get that person to finally release that, to, to hit that red button Yo, on that. No, this is leak. literally the track. This is the track. Maybe this it is, is the track. Or maybe it's a leak. Or maybe somebody just hacked him. Or maybe the weekend's right. There is some type of. You know, whatever in the camp, whatever leaks in the operation, makes y'all feel okay. So well, you know what this does for certain. If it's remotely real, it's time to engage. Now, this is what I could tell what the culture is gonna do. You see, the culture I keep telling you they treat what Drake do different from what Kendrick do. You know what y'all gonna say? Well, it, well, that shit not as hot as like that. So, yo, Kendrick don't even gotta respond. He already won. Thank when you. it comes to Kendrick, he don't gotta do shit. He, he y'all just give him all type of W's. <laughs> okay. They already have a rap genius for the song. Yeah. That, but that's just academics covering it. And he did say it could be AI, could be a leak, it could be this. And and we, that's who we were waiting for confirmation. Thank you. Yeah, he right? did not give and us. He doesn't know. Act doesn't know at this point right now. He waited for the boy to drop it. But yo, does having a rap genius mean that it's an official track? It no. doesn't, but for some reason, it kind of substantiates or like I don't know, like no, it gives rap, it a little just, bit of credibility. Just rap yeah. genius, they're a blog, just like yeah, else, and no? they're just for um explaining the lyrics to songs on some of them, right? On some of their posts and stuff, like and they that's probably crazy. think it's a that's real. They mean. probably think it's real. <laughs> then they're idiots. What if it's real, Dusty? I that's think not, it might. It might be real, man. man. Yo, man, this guy, you, <laughs> got, you got champagne sitting at home, just laughing at man's right now. Like, I wouldn't even dare DM him right now. Is that real? Yo, you, know, you should has, do it right now and screen record it and add it to the pod. Because yo, be like, <laughs> don't have me out here looking crazy. Oh my God, Friday's doing it. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna DM him. DM him. But like, yo, the man that's what right happens here. when you at We Love Hip Hop. Man, you know right what I'm saying? Connections, Owl, OVO. You know what I'm saying? Yo, Big up B3 yo, Studio. Look, there's video. another post here from Keep Six, right? Hold on before I do that. I'm video calling. I'm not video calling. I'm yeah, not no, calling the boy. Yo, video calling. Video calling. Video, call. video calling, bro. <laughs> Bet you he picks up. He there's no out. way I'm calling the boy. He won't answer, man. So look, Keep Six just posted something. Yeah. Okay. Um, what's a pr- uh, prince to a king? He a son, nigga. So he's quoting the lyrics in his caption. So this is becoming more and more real. Wow. Shut up, B3. <laughs> <laughs> this might be real, fam. This more and more as the time as we're potting, more people are posting. They're like, yo, we're hype, we're hype now. Yeah, everybody's jumping out of the building now. <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. Oh, no. If Champagne don't post it. 
It's not real, dog. Yeah, that, hit him up. Yeah, until he up. claims that, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not. Yo, so he says, "I need that war time." Are ah. there are there any tracks that like analyze or any programs that analyze tracks and like can tell whether it's AI or not? We might have to run it through one of those. Mm. To run it through the yeah, yeah, they do, they do. It's like a sample. The Does sample the track machine, have right? a name or no? Drink um, this. What was I don't know. I don't you know. You see, what was the name? Because I'm on Drake's that. Genius right now. Yeah, and I don't see the track cover. Fam, you're not going to because Drake did not drop it. Because yeah, it's not a real song. Yeah, I'm just. I just text him. Yo, is that real, brother? The truth. Boom. Send. Right, cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Keep that Ow. open. Watch, him, ha- watch him just leave us pure laughing emojis. He's gonna emojis. leave me on scene, bro. He's gonna give you a laughing emoji and be like, "You the see, scene everybody's like crazy, jumping bro. on the burning <laughs> building. The place isn't even on fire yet, and everyone's jumping out the windows." I don't got that kind of status like Ak, bro. I don't think he's gonna give yeah, me the. I don't even down. got it. He leave, he leave Ak on red too. Stop this, I, especially after that's TV. his go to. Apparently, they're no, saying it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. Or else, dump, uh, Ak would not be. Sitting here and drop and give me 50 is the song name. Drop and give me 50. I think you know, dad, that's what I see right here. Um, it only has 920 views in an hour because it's not real. Everybody's in 53 speculating. minutes. Oh, it's gone. Thank you. It's gone from foundation <laughs> media. You want to know why? Go, his people hit him up and say, You guys put out that weak. No, even the one that we were looking at before. Yo, we just witnessed this get restricted in real time. Yes. Subscribe to We Love Hip Hop. Yo, fam. <laughs> for real. <laughs> for real. <laughs> subscribe. Subscribe, though. For Don't real. forget we to look. You see what we like button. <laughs> Live and direct. I just pressed. Um, <laughs> what you did, it was like a I just, classic. I just did a um, history on my, on my history right here, right? Yeah. It's gone. Bro. It's gone, fam. The, what we just listened to two seconds ago or like a 20 minutes ago, it's gone. What was that yeah, account yeah. name again? We still good over it. Rap Vivo. Rap Vivo. What happened gone. to Rap Vivo? <laughs> we still good over it. 56 they, subscribers. They got a strike. Yo. Wait, Foundation Media. What is that? What is Foundation Media? Because it said that's what, uh, that's the company that like put on the restrictions. Mm. Is that company connected to Drake? Do they own the rights of that song? Is that an actual song that you can be copyrighted for? Or is it an AI thing? What, what is thing AI happened thing? to Ghost Rider, bro? No, what is foundation? Fam. Someone search Foundation Media LLC. What is that? You see the thing? Uh, yo, B3, quick um, fact check there. You see the thing is, if it got deleted, it gives me more valid a validation that it's real. What, am I, what foundation? What what was it? Me- because media. they're not gonna they're not gonna copyright an LLC. AI. Yeah, yeah. There's still Drake AI songs that are out now. Yes, there. It's going to be Drake's people or the company, the record company that is being released through using the metadata. They read the metadata online and say, "Oh, that's ours. That's ours. That's ours." Boom, 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 boom. That's how it works. Yeah. Right. So if they're trying to strike people or take down stuff because they're using somebody's metadata, it might be real, real. metadata. Yeah. Uh, they, Foundation Media. It looks like a, a label, bro. Okay. Are they connected to any other record labels? Um, I'm on their page association right now. with a Universal. Rep, um, I think Drake's on re- releasing through Republic right now. Multi-purpose yep. media and marketing company specialized in distribution and label services. So they work with labels. So they probably do the they do the vetting out for labels online, like they do the metadata analysis. Yes, the searching for people who are doing copyrights. You know what I'm saying? But mm-hmm. so if there's already people that's who are show you that's not real, then that's what I'm. Would, no, that's to prove that it is real. Because if it's AI, ain't nobody trying to take no copyright. They can still AI. do copyright claims they do if co- they imitate their artists. artists bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 They, You're ghost, that me. Ghost Rider guy got got taken like, yeah, down you several can't times. Imitate. You can't. Okay, and yeah. you cannot so meta. Like, when you're talking about the meta, you took my face. And I'll have it on your page. Yeah, that, but that's an available picture of Drake. Like that's gonna, gonna use but that. that yeah. I'm gonna go at you for that today. You're putting out false, false work of mine. That's false. That's not the diss record. All right, there you're yeah. messing me yeah. up. We just, just witnessed it deleted real, real the, time. Yo, yo, but, the, the first, my bad. The first Drake AI that came out mm. got like was was got way more traction than this one right away, mm. right? And because it was that like popular that quick, it got mm. taken down. Like just as this one got taken down, for but the it same got put reason. back up though, no. He got, but he had to go re-upload. He kept re-uploading it. The, right. the Ghost Rider guy just kept re-uploading oh. it in different spots, different times, and different ways, and different names, and, mm. and by whatever, then it's right? already viral. So other people are yeah, re-uploading other people it too. Are doing yeah. it too. Because yeah. right? I'm thinking like. With AI, they still haven't figured out laws yet to be like, yeah. you can't use my voice. 
So well, maybe for Drake, it's there. <laughs> All right, you're dealing with the biggest artist in the world. You're not taking nothing that sounds like me, especially in wartime, and making me look crazy. Because it's defamation too, right? Woke, it's like yo, what did I say? Me. He woke up at two o'clock today and seen this madness. Lawyer, oh, what is going on? Yeah, that's yeah. not even a record, B. Yeah. Now so, I have to drop the record. Is that still up? Is that still I up? I should have downloaded it right away. I usually download it right away. Let me see what keep six. Mm. Refresh the, that. Refresh that. I wonder what if it's gone. You're gonna. You're it won't not, be gone off of not, Instagram, not, right? Nah, you don't man. think so? No, nah. nah, man. And imagine everyone's anticipating Drake right now to drop a record, and then someone comes with this bullshit. Now YouTube is definitely the first spot they go to to take it down. And then Instagram is probably a little trickier to get everybody to. We when it's that real time, it's actually kind of crazy. Was it on Spotify? No. No, it never was. No, that's the first place I checked to see if, you. if it was if Drake, on Drake's page. If, Drake, if it's not on Drake's page, if he didn't post it, it's not it, yeah. dog. But I do agree that's with cool. Friday that it kind of proves that it might be real because like they're scrambling <laughs> to get it off platform. Damn, this is crazy. How could that be? Yo, they're real? gonna scramble regardless because like we're in mid-war right now. So yeah. this this is a sh like technically somebody shooting for Drake. At that, yeah, at that, yeah at that point, right? that's it, and that's false propaganda. Yeah. Like, that's actually false and advertising. If, if this is a flop, and he shoot, he this it's is somebody. Else, right, they're gonna look at Drake like, all right, you lost, Kendrick won. Thank you. Yeah, Get it what, off the internet. What if this is a leak? He could have easily been like, that's an AI record. He could easily make a story being like, all like even just crying emojis, like this ain't even real. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. if it was fake, he, I feel like he would take that route, but that is total speculation. Nah, He's probably I mean, just not entertaining it. Like, fam, yo, you don't entertain get rid it. of it. Uh, 48 hour rule or 78 hour rule. If you don't talk about it, they forget about it. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, the last story post was 13 hours ago. What is that? Yeah, what even is that? It I looks saw like that. some snow, some blizzard or something like that. Over what? A bag? Uh, he's in a car? It looks like it. looks like the blizzard outside of a window or something. Oh, it's something I thought it was cryptic. a marble table with like something. See what I'm saying? Probably like only the people who are being dissed know what that means. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like yeah. super like, like, insider like. No way cut, he just you posted know? that on the Like story. you were here when this went down. Yeah. Remember this? Remember this? Remember you this know picture? this? Remember this property? That's yeah. all you seen when I punched, when so-and-so punch your lights out. <laughs> right? <laughs> okay, let's get off of this. <laughs> we'll, we'll circle. We'll probably have to circle back and give an update before the end of the podcast because it's, it's happening in real time right now gang um i want to send a quick r.i.p to um ggg member jason mm, friday 13th fred that's his that's his name um, that's what, that's what you know, yeah yeah, I know yeah. Him as around the hood. um yeah I, I just see five posting him as jason and stuff i've met him a f couple of times on road and stuff like that very cool brother too you know what i'm saying there was like a triple shooting that happened in the middle of downtown yeah portland yeah 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 queen, queen of portland. portland yeah 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 so r.i.p to him yeah um let, let's keep the peace out here fam it's a mod thing bro like you know just even as us as we grow in our popularity and different things like that i'm we don't have nowhere near the same kind of issues that these guys have but we have to always keep our head on a swivel as known people going out there in these streets, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. you never know who's watching you and all that type of stuff, bro. So I, I just yeah. wanted to to to, to walk put with that God, out there. Yeah. I walk with God. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I treat people like how I want to be treated, right? Yeah, man. I try to. You know what I mean? You got to. This is from Top Five's page here. The only God knows. Yeah, Two Mollies in a fucking Lambo. You know what I'm saying? And, and and hold your head to five. You know what I'm saying? Um, I, I spoke to him not too long ago just for people who are looking for a quick um top five update. He's he's in good spirits. You know what I'm saying? Um, For the people who care. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm yeah. sure he's, he's very polarizing. He has 50 people, 50, 50, 50% 50 of the people who are like, I don't care, I keep yeah. him. And then 50% who want to know this, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's in good spirits. Um, he's looking forward to his, his trial date coming yeah. up in the, in the, in the fall time. And, yeah, man. Like anytime I speak to him, he doesn't. He never sounds down. You know what I'm saying? He just amp wants to know what's going on with the scene. Yeah. So like talking about another person on the scene, uh, he just dropped something with Damian Cruz. Yeah, the, yeah, the Walking yeah. Dead. Yeah, yeah. He just dropped the new tune. Yeah. Him and Damian Cruz. From what I heard, they have a whole EP. Get out of here. It's a whole damn EP. A whole damn. No, 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 no. Whole EP. Whole album. Right. So that's pretty dope. He's still moving. And doing his thing, you know what I mean? Like top yeah, five, yeah, like yeah. he's at, he's actually gonna be kept alive in a sense by being on other rappers' stuff, and yeah, so that's pretty dope. Well, fam, like you know, before we get off of this, right? Can we agree that from when top top five's been gone for like two years now? Yeah, low key. 
when you really think about it, besides being on the run and all that, like being locked away, like waiting for his trial, it's been over a year. Yeah. Can we agree that the scene kind of died down since he went away? It's always been, <laughs> we don't have a scene. And then whatever he was bringing to the scene, we didn't, we didn't take it and make him bigger. We actually kind of messed him up too by exposing his. Well, where's, where's the last time y'all seen academics do a live stream with uh, Toronto Mans? Because none of them can hold it down. I'm sorry to say, Friday, they can't hold it down like the youth. There we right? go. There's only a couple youths out here that can really hold it down. And not only that, get the connection to um, to yeah. academics. Yeah. Get the connection. Like his album had bare features, so he made a lot of connections. Like very much so. The man is a mover and shaker, bro. I got got to give him his credit for that. Like give him his credit. For he that. had the scene really, really buzzing, mm-hmm. even without the op shit. Like just going on live and like seeing yeah. him in the morning, freaking having some jokes with some Indian kid in India or whatever. Yeah, for real, like, for real, for real. It just, he just knew how to keep things buzzing. He man. did, he did the unexpected. Mm. That's not expected. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. that's what kept, that's what everybody knows him. Like, bro, you go across the world and they know about top five. Fam. There's bare that's, documentary that's, pieces on this kid, that's bro. That's crazy. Yeah. Uh, right? But it's like now when you, if you come out, are you really going to just concentrate on the music or are you going to flip and be a, a weirdo? That's the question. You know what I'm saying? From like I said, from the conversations I've had with him, he's he's still so he cares about the scene and like, you know, what's going on and, you know, how big it's growing. Mm-hmm. That I think even if he doesn't come out and go straight to doing music, yeah. he'll be somewhere in the music industry doing something. Because yeah. I've always said this about five, uh, you know, he could be a great A&R. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like he knows, oh, this guy and this guy should get on a track together. Yo, get this producer on the beat. Yo, you should, guys should do this with your video. Like he could be a marketing manager, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or run his own label for real. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. But yeah, man, salute to top five. Salute to, to um, Fri- Friday the 13th. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Jason. AKA Jason. You know what I'm saying? Um, RIP to him. Condolences to his family. Yeah, man. Just an- another big loss in the, another loss for, for those guys. You know what I'm saying? Yep. And for, for the people who love him. Um, do y'all want to get into this young boy versus finesse yeah. two times thing? Yeah, let's go. Big salute to Steaman Hot Grabber with a variety of different grabber flavors and dispensers. They got Red Rose Grabber, that Red Herring Grabber, and Peanut Butter. Hit them up on their Instagram page, Steaman Hot Grabber, and use the code We Love Hip Hop and receive a discount on your order. Again, you can find them on Instagram, Steaman Hot Grabber. Now let's get back to the show. Cheer. Are you guys have been up on what's going no, on? I'm here? up on it. I'm up on it. Bitch. <laughs> Should I take it to Twitter? No, you got to go right to the gram, bro. Um, who's you, who's? Let me go on Finesse's two times. Finesse two times Instagram. So apparently, there's been a whole back and forth that started with them. Mm-hmm. Just to give some context, I guess Finesse two times liked one of NBA Young Boy's baby mom's pictures, which is the most pettiest thing in the world to get mad at. Right? Yeah, yeah, for sure. And then just what happened from there? You you have a little bit more. Uh, yeah, he just was like, he um he tried to backdoor it, right? Mm. And then after he's like, uh, and then I think NBA young boy either liked back a picture of his his girl, yeah, finesse two times or posted it or something, and then he tr- finesse must have went again and hit up NBA girl. right, and he goes. And he looked at his girl and he goes, can I, can I pretty much fuck, finesse two times women? Like, can I do this? Mm. But he doesn't know finesse two times girl is an actual flesh worker, right? <laughs> and she'll charge you 200K just to hit that ass. Mm. Okay? Co- cost of war, though. <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah. Right? Cost of war. <laughs> cost of war, right? <laughs> but, like, they're both crazy, man. Now, honestly, I don't know. They must got some albums dropping or something, but it's some lame shit. Look, man. I won't hear no mental issues. Man. Oh my! What's, what's up with this kid, man? You got this demon off a of meth, and now you gotta go get him smoking it again. What's wrong with him? It's, 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 here's the thing, though. Cause I heard the whole, and I'm gonna, tr- I'm trying to find that little snippet of NBA young boy talking, you need bitch. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's the part. Right? I love that though. Like, yo, the man went off for like ten minutes. <laughs> How are these mans fighting over girls? 
we keep on having these conversations week after week after week, fam. And like I've seen the they girl wanna, that they're fighting with they, over, with yeah. all due respect, they're not the hottest chicks in the world, no, fam. They're, 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 that, that ghetto ass pussy. That's oh, oh come on, fam. You, the guys are willing to crash out for that, bro. Want, yeah. Yes, they are. I think I think we need to have a real conversation in hip hop on what's going on. An, an inter- intervention. intervention, fam. An intervention. Like man's are like they're making too much money. Wanna, guys are changing their life too much to crash out over I these girls. Test bro. drive your thing though. Okay. That's how it is now. So you say uh, you want, you're gonna crash out for the thing, right? It's the same thing the man's test driving. You're gonna crash out for. Well, that's a good question, right? Let's put it. Let's ask ourselves this question. We're yeah. we're popping podcasters now yeah okay yeah um a next podcaster hits 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 up one of our girls yeah that's his problem right? you gotta deal with the bitch now yeah good luck good no luck, no nigga. but i'm saying like your girl tells you yo i'm not gonna put any names on there but you know joe button try to hit up hit up yeah. hit, hit me up i'd be like oh cool back door him <laughs> bring him over i'd be pissed at joe button you'd be pissed no I wouldn't like that. I'd be like, you, you, and not, I'm going to let you go in a second, right? Yeah. You're a podcaster, so you've expressed on air, me yeah. and my girl went to do this. this. So he knows you have a girl. Yeah, that's yeah. disrespectful. That's just Ooh. breaking the code between men. Oh, see, that's between the thing. Men. You can't get mad at the dude. You got to get mad at the bitch. It depends mm. how she reacts, too, and like how can't she leads at, him. You can't get mad at the player. She could lead him on. That's where the simp shit comes in. You know what I mean? Yeah. Right? That's where. See, now you got to play it real smoother than a baby's bottom in this situation. You got to be ready to fly with the birds. You know what I mean? So she be doing. If if there's some slick shit going on like that, you got to be on top of your pimping, in a sense, to be like. Yeah, it makes you look worse if you. You give a fuck if you give a fuck. You if don't you know, crash out too really? much, really? Yeah, the best you, thing you look more yeah, like you, a, you don't want to look too like insecure. The best yeah, thing is not insecure. to care when you when you don't care, it doesn't hurt as much. Yeah, you get what I'm saying? I'm being real. Like it's like that's that, no, that's that side you gotta have in you to know that you're a celeb, you're yeah. this and you're that. People are gonna be coming at you all types of ways. Nine, Nine times out of ten, the show you, know you have she's to doing have too. under. Yeah, you have to, it's the girl you would more have to have under uh, manners. Yeah, mm-hmm. all right. Facts, and facts. if your girl can't hold down her her pom pom, then that's on that's on that's on her. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You mm-hmm. get away from that, find a better bitch. That's me, all it is. Let me play what finesse two times had to say here. It's not your girl, it's just your turn. <laughs> I ain't understand what this shit was about. I ain't know what you were talking about, homie. I ain't I ain't even respect what you was on. You don't speak young boy. But you still throw it off for want to beef with a nigga cause a nigga liking your bitch post. Bro, nigga like sugar posts, nigga like my bitches posts all the time, bro. You don't mm. see me shooting at no nigga. It's all type of That's NBA what I'm saying. players, football players, players. shit and sugar shit, nigga. You don't see me going at them, nigga. You That's talking true. about real gangsters, the nigga. Wind is real crazy. gangsters don't cry right. about women, nigga. Real gangsters don't, don't go cry. to war about women. Nope. And like I said, man, you know what I'm saying? You just a young nigga, you don't know. You need no to go to a way less windier man. area. You know what I'm saying? We make easy money. Why is he on a farm? Home, man, he's serious. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You a young boy. You don't know nothing about this shit right here, man. You. I can't. I can't. The wind is just driving me crazy. And the way they speak that broken English, man. <laughs> it just sound like, hey, boo, the body, boo, man. Boo, the body, boo, 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 No, but uh, (laughs) I I do think uh, he has a good point because, yeah, NBA players, celebrities are going to like your girl's picture, especially if you're a public figure. So you can't get pissed at every time. But if it's someone you know, I feel like you're allowed to. More times it is going to be someone you know. If it's someone that claims to be your friend, it's going to be somebody who's your your friend. That's disrespectful. That's weird. It's It's just two different things. If it's somebody who claims to be your friend, that is disrespectful. It very much so. But if you're an entertainer and you bump into guys at games and concerts, you you don't know each other. You don't owe each other anything. Oh, yeah. You You don't even know if they already had sex before. That they ain't even telling you. That part. These guys all fuck the same women, dog. Yeah, yeah, that could have been his before. Remember how many times Drake has said, like, you're looking at him like you've had him before. I heard him Uh, say that in a line, right? uh, 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 A certain uh, line Drake said, he's like, you know? (laughs) <laughs> that's like, too many lines about the gal that's then, a heartbreaking bro. bar <laughs> right it's like how do I know you haven't been with him before the way you're looking at him you know yeah like it's the like, way you hugged him oh I know said, those hugs yeah. yeah I know those hugs it's a little bit too long 
Let's yeah. pass the three second rule. Yeah. Y'all hug up everybody. Yeah. Y'all hug up everybody. A little bit too much hip in yeah. the hug. He made him feel the camel toe right on his, yeah. right on his thigh. He you made can him tell feel by the, the hip. You can mm. tell by the hip to hip distance whether or not yeah. they've smashed. The hug has yeah. to be where the butt, the hip yeah. is pushed out. It's, yep. And that's a secure, that's a cool hug. hug. Yeah. And if that's the a tap. And there's a tap. And there's a tap. Thank you. There's just a tap. But if the hip is in, and now the hip, like the two, <laughs> the two private parts, can touch yeah, each other like yeah, through the clothes, the friction. right? And now, and and the, and the arms wrap a little bit more, yeah, right. You can say whatever you want. In you got to look at your chick later, like hey, yo. They've rubbed belly buttons before. Yeah, they're rubbing belly buttons right now while they're hugging. Right now, <laughs> right, right. They're so close to. You kissing. might need to pull the bitch off of this nigga. Like, nah, yo, just let the them. What are you doing? Why are you hugging get, this nigga see, so that's long? That's what I won't do. I let him. <laughs> That's what I won't do. I'll be like, bitch, go do your thing. Cause I'm gonna do mine over here. Yeah, I think I think physically that's different. Like that's disrespect. But uh, liking somebody's picture is not disrespect. Ah, well, you it know depends. what? You know what? Girls say the same thing to uh, to us when we're liking other women's pictures. And they, we Yo, totally it's don't the even internet. know the bitch. Like, <laughs> calm down, you don't like, even know the bitch. But how does your bitch know that you're you've liked the bitch? That's what you like? <laughs> Yes, I do. Damn, I'm just kind of fat ass. <laughs> oh, no, come here. You want to see some more of this bitch? I don't even yeah, know. Yeah, hey, that's what you like. All these BBL bitches, <laughs> eh? Yo, B3, B3, let me, let me, let me put you in a scenario. I like BBW. Say, Let's say go. you have a girl, right? Yeah, yeah. And then she's liking a picture of a guy shirtless who looks nothing like you. She's, she's liking to. all his oh, pictures. Yeah, she's I've probably seen it. going to. Yeah, she's no, going to. No, but like you're cool with that? I'm like, probably going to like a, 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 a bitch that has a big tits and uh, yeah. nice ass. No, but are you cool with like the principal guiding the action? Like if <laughs> if now she's DMing that was a good one. if she's DMing so like that's that a guy good one, dog. that's a problem. Like that. That was a if she's DMing one. the guy, that's a problem. Is yeah. the guy's yeah. re- messaging her and she's responding? That's a problem. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But if it's a like, you're on Instagram to get likes. You're on Instagram yeah. to get comments. You're on stay Instagram erase. to stay erase all that. So you're know? cool with her liking this guy's pictures all the time. What sure can you list. do? She has a finger. I know you can't do it. anything. You can first of all. You can yeah. you can either get her on a, a better program or <laughs> program uh, Mamba. <laughs> it's like a lot of hate in the building. Let's go. <laughs> she has to be in line. Yeah, uh, she has to be in line. <laughs> no, nah, but like, yo, you can express that too. Like, I don't like you liking all this guy's shirtless pictures. Okay, nah. okay. Let me, then, let me ask go. you this. Let me ask you this. I let me ask not you say this. that. When, I know it sounds you've been, insecure a little bit. You've been in a relationship before. I'd rather just yeah. tell her you're niggas you've never liked a single girl's picture on instagram ever while being in your relationship not a, a single picture i'm gonna be real the way i operate in at least in my last few relationships is like it's kind of said that like i won't disrespect you by liking girls pictures especially girls that i've already smashed and like you don't do the same either you know what i'm saying but how do you know you never you never know because your girls have burner accounts too thank eh? you the burner the burner Thank you. Again. <laughs> that, Thank you. That's where they'll do the liking button. And they have the best erasing program ever. Yeah. They can erase like everything. You can you can actually literally track it. That's how much they erase. You can literally know. track it. Personally, like it just wouldn't be ideal for me to have my girl like liking other dudes pictures i would rather her not you know what i'm yeah, saying yeah but then that's simp shit man you can't you can't really you know you got to be like go ahead it's not like the nigga's gonna reach out the fucking phone and start having sex with her i know like, yeah, but like, it's also know. a trust <laughs> it's also like a respect thing where it's like yo you're representing me as as you being my girl like you're an extension of me yo, I, yo, listen you know if there's your, it's not your girl it's your turn yeah if if I don't like that, <laughs> <laughs> it's, your, it's your turn, my brother. Just let me tell you that they're never your girl, never our girl. That's, That's a whole girl. another conversation. Yeah, they're they're just it's just our turn. Yeah, she, as quick as they'll. Yeah, she's you. never your girl to begin with. Though. It was it, it's, yeah. it's it's just your. What time. if she's a virgin? Then I'm not with her. The fuck. I would I, I wouldn't need a virgin. There there would be no no time for a virgin. Well, at our ages now, well, maybe you guys, y'all might have more op, uh, chances. I know, say opportunities, opportunities chances to find a virgin. <laughs> no, 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 no. Because <laughs> no, y'all are still wouldn't. in your 20s. That's impossible. <laughs> yeah. no. That's real. Ha- the chances no. are very low. Yeah. Yeah. Low, yeah. low for low. us, they're nil. <laughs> if yeah, I don't we, think if we find a, four, a 30-something-year-old virgin, throw away, bro. Nah, something's wrong <laughs> what, if, with that what if she was a cat. nun? What if she was a nun and then like she switched maybe, up after? That's maybe. still something wrong with that That she switched up after? No, like no, no, broke I, her out. I, I'm, I'm <laughs> like, somebody who like they just got out the covenant now and they're like, I want to try you for the first time. That might be something wild. That might be that something, might be something that wild, might be but next unexperienced level. as hell. 
Yeah, but she, she just has a lot of aggression that she's been holding up in the, the Montessori right. or in whatever. The church. She <laughs> in wouldn't the even know how to ride properly. She'd just be all over the place. Like, ah! My brain's going crazy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's and she just... still got on a nun. nun. <laughs> that's where, that's yeah. probably where I was going with it. My bad. Yeah, yeah. My bad. My bad. I, I, I Sorry, gods. <laughs> God ain't gonna say nothing. He's gonna be like, at least you hitting that. Let's see what young boy got to say here. Oh, oh. shit, boy. Hey, boy. No, hold on. I boy, love this kid. You sound like a bitch who I kicked, kicked out, out, nigga. I ain't trying to hit the best one. What the hell, shit, I'm gonna boy. use that. <laughs> when he says, you sound, yo, yo, when he bitch, said, yeah, it, it, it hits me. Yeah. <laughs> yo, yeah, 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 bro. I love how he says it. <laughs> bitch. With, the, <laughs> with like, them whoa. fake teeth in his mouth, it just looks right. He charges up before this. No. You know. And he has a you cigarette in his hand like he a heroin addict. Phase, nigga. <laughs> you wrote my hoe. I wrote my hoe. I ain't tell you nothing, bitch. I, po I told your hoe something. This bitch ass nigga want to at me. I ain't tell your bitch ass. I ain't tell your botched ass nigga when you wrote, when you played with my hoe nigga. I just post your bitch. Keep that thing gangster. Then go back and play with my wife, man. That ain't no bitch. That ain't that, ain't that, that, ain't that, ain't that bitch that you fake pepping, nigga. Whew. No, man. This kid is a I, de this kid's a demon, guys. I ain't, I ain't your friend. I ain't no watch this, you. Bitch. None of they won't even let Yo, him out the house. He's on a lot of drugs, bro. <laughs> I know he's off of it. He, is is he? Because he they sounds like he's it. chewing on his gums, bro. Yeah, he probably just hit, <laughs> probably just hit some sherm or something <laughs> like that. <laughs> no, but that's that New Orleans twang, right? <laughs> if you, if you ever really hear those New Orleans guys, it almost sounds like Creole French all in one. English. Yeah, like, true. They sound they sound a little. Boy. I keep on yeah. putting drugs on all of these yeah, guys' jackets. All these southern guys. It's just their accent. Bad. It is bad. <laughs> just their twang just makes them slow and just really, really. I'm sorry, man. I'm going right? to stop doing that to these guys. Right? <laughs> Some of them are not even on this shit. Oh, my God. You a hoe, man. You a hoe, man. Man, we were against us, man. And bitch, we so G'd around here, nigga. My eye, I politely ask my wife. My eye, what? I politely ask my wife. Double back and play with me like that. Oh, Do what she did. Holy. My Bonix translator didn't get all that. No, she said, no, yeah. said, I'll tell you. It said error. It said error. <laughs> I'll tell you. I'll tell you right now. Syntax he's, error. He said, I was even polite and I asked my wife if I could F these two other bitches. And she gave a two thumbs up. Wow. That's what he said. Uh, thank you. Because <laughs> I didn't catch that neither. Uh, I'll be a tra I'll be a trans I tuned out. I tuned out slow. Place. Once I got that syntax error, I was like, yo, Dusty, oh, Dusty. W wife. Oh, no. this you know. W wife. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. W, w wife. for the wife? W wife. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. W. Hey, babe, can, can I, I uh, can I smash these two shorties because over? Because the here? man's trying to hit on <laughs> you. Yes, sir. The man's trying to hit on you. And it's like you he probably asked baby, he's like, You want that fat and she's like, Hell no. You NBA. Yeah. I'm like, All right. He's like, <laughs> what, what's that? Where does he live again? What's his place called again? What, what, um, something mountain. Something mountain. Grave Diggers Grave Mountain. Digger Mountain. <laughs> you want to come? Imagine this kid calling you and saying, you want to come over here, Grave Digger Mountain? Beep. No, he sent her a message. Yep. Um, He put the mountain, Grave Digger, and he said, and he put the mountain emoji. To yeah, the, to the girl that that's what set off everything. Yeah, mm. right. Yeah, <laughs> like, like an emoji and Cut my house. Like, that's just basically Cut a to my house. super short form. Come to the green. <laughs> like, Come to my house. That's a sick way to I freaking know. tell somebody yeah, to pull mountains. up. <laughs> Grave digger, mountain so, emoji. Yo, you know what's funny though? They have to put this. <laughs> Just wait for the door to open. <laughs> <laughs> yo, he's been on house arrest for the last, I don't know how long. I think two years, right? Now. And you're and they just put you up in the mountain somewhere. They're like, you cannot have this. This guy does his interviews up there. He's walking around with horses. <laughs> and, and a goat. The, 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 the goat the other day. You got a sheep with him, actually. All his Name music Moses. videos are up there, <laughs> like in the one spot. Yeah, his man's just in front of his car in his driveway. Oh everything, man, bro. His, like, sat, his life is boring right now. Eh, it's probably so bored. Listen, man, salute to NBA young boy, salute mm. to finesse. You, there may be too bored, yeah. right? Like, stop crashing on over these women, okay? And this, I feel like we're becoming a, a repeating a, a broken record every week. We're like, guys, chill out over the girls. The girls are more important now than the rappers. Rap is at a bad state. Yo, the W on these women out here in the game. Yeah, it's a recurring they, theme. Yes. Yeah, they know what they're doing. They're more important than the rapper. Like, like what? We're not going to the club to see these rappers no more. We're going to the club to see this yeah, big you, booty. You rarely see the, the female rappers crash out or have any problems. With men? Over dudes? Yeah. Most of them are with women, too. You gotta be real. A lot of them are already with women. Like, in terms of news, and, and since this year has yeah. started, it's been... 
the the males kind of fucking up crashing men, out over their girls because the men are all on some feminine juice. Look at Uzi. Did you see Uzi oh was my was God. on the stage? Oh <laughs> my god! And when he's like, when he's like, I want to tell you guys something. <laughs> and he smiled for like. <laughs> I was like, he about to tell us what he really is. No. And he no. didn't say it. And Uzi's my favorite artist. Say, eh? don't get it twisted. But I've always told you guys, some of our favorite artists are. Didn't you say the best, um, the best guy, the best musicians Rainbows are gay? <laughs> are part of the rainbow oh team. Goodness. Are part of the rainbow team. He's always been a little feminine, though. You know it. Yeah. But he's more gangster than Meat Mill. You think all the Beatles were gay? You know what? Here, 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 right here, 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 here. <laughs> Important secret. Why is he slouch? Like Luda, Luda, what's going what is he on? doing? Well. Oh, my God. Why is he What acting? is happening here, man? Why is he you know what he's like acting there? like? He's and he's got a Rockefeller chain on too, bro. Acting like a city girl. He been to free cars. Yo, fam. Rockefeller chain on top of that, fam. No, bro. We're the, we're in the Bizarro universe at this point, yes, fam. We are. Everything's upside down. He, but I've he's been holding this for a very long time. Yo, the man, man has cr- oh, uh, no. wave curls, like the waves, I'm pretty sure uh, finger waves. A lot of you already knew this. <laughs> what is finger waves going yeah. on? About me. What? About me. But he has I'm, blush on. I'm gay. What I want to tell y'all tonight is right here. I thought he was gonna say it. I love y'all. I was like, God damn. Yeah, he probably knew he, what he was doing. He's still like, super, super zesty, though. And he then is. he starts voguing. I hope no matter what, y'all love me the same way I love y'all. The man looks like Rudolph with the, the, the two. That's your boy. Watch the move. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, 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 oh, yes, my yes, 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 Oh, yes, my yes, God. Yes, this yes, is the part yes, that gets yes, me. Yes, yes, the drop? Yes, the drop. Yes, the drop. Yes, 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 yo, this yes, is for yes, that. Yes, this is for yes, the community, yes, dog. Yes, that. Yes, <laughs> that's not good. Uh, <laughs> that's not good. Uh, <laughs> that's not good, that's guys. That's the main yes, dance for it. That's the main move for that world, eh? That is Actually, a crazy move. Though. I've never seen that in my life. Yo, they have a page for it where the dudes they just drop. They're they, called this, death drops or something like that. Right? Whatever or, it is, it's a <laughs> it's a it's a cultural thing where they they they're in a room, music's playing, and this is how these guys and girls are dancing right now. Mm. They drop like that, but it's on a their Vogue. leg. It's the hot. Yeah, it's the it's the backwards. LGBTQT ABCDEFG. That's their dances right now. That's like a gay break dance. Thank move. you. But you gotta, you know, you can't, yo, watch it. <laughs> that's crazy, though. I feel like like that's a hard move to Madonna do. Madonna came up with it first, Vogue, but Voguing was always around. Voguing was around, but she popularized she it. Popped like it. She popularized it. I'd probably crazy. mess up my knee if I tried to hand shit. This is, this, this was my song, though. This song was oh, fire. This is a, this this is is a popular song. Yeah, he was doing music. that. Mads were doing that back in, in the, the days, club. Right? Like in the club, hardcore, like real, real niggas was yeah, doing that. The moves, because like there was like break dancing. It's right, compose. There's nothing to it. That move right there, that that little spin I think move. I've spin, seen that. Yeah, that's what Uzi was remaking right yeah, there on the but, stage. But they do it very feminine. And I think in this video they did that little that that split yeah. drop thing. They did that in this video. And that's too. what Jay said. What, during the splits, you gonna bust your pants. Mm, well, I think he was talking about uh, something else, but yeah, you know. same move. <laughs> probably talking about those moves. Salute to Uzi Vert, man. Oh man. Um, we you know we gotta touch some no jumper news for a quick second, man. Let's do it. We love no jumper. <laughs> we love no jumper. We love no jumper. Um, in no no in no jumper news, <laughs> Dijon Paul gets shot. Well, with a name like Dijon Paul, do you have any great poop on? <laughs> well, okay, we were just, you know, this is a, this is a great transition from Vogue. The yeah. Dijon Paul, openly gay, yeah. um, no jumper host. He actually just came out not too long ago, right before his disappearance. <laughs> Weirdly <laughs> enough, hold on. <laughs> right? Man, who the Dijon, man? What, what's going on? So this is courtesy of um, Community Clips. So big salute to Big Pun and, uh, and um, AD and the whole AD. gang over there. They're reacting to hearing about Dijon getting shot because over at No Jumper, he's usually on the news and he has his own podcast now with Flacco, um, Here We Go Again, right? Mm-hmm. But since he came out, nobody on nobody's given him any pushback on No Jumper. Nobody's been like, ah, oh, we don't want to do any potting with you. We're just not working with you every day. No, they seem pretty cool, yeah. but they never said nothing since he disappeared. They've been silent. Well, bro, that's a some dangerous stuff just happened. Well, apparently he got shot by the security. 
security. Wow. By no jumper security? By no jumper security. Yo, that for guy's going to have mental issues for the rest of his life. And he took no jumper out of his bio. Out of on his on his Instagram. Because he about to sue their ass. He That's about, what I'm saying. And he about to sue. I'm, I'm going to play this because it's funny oh. you said that. <laughs> it's I just saw a funny picture. you said that. I just saw a picture now Ooh, where he yes. on a crutch walking around right now. What? So he done got where he need a crutch? He's on crutches? That's oh, he right. really go. He go sue sue. Oh, AD's man. dying. He done, he done got shot where he need a crutch. I, I saw a picture of him on a crutch today. Because AD was there when, when, when Adam oh, got damn. attacked one time with a They say he removed true. his name out of there and all that. Yeah. So. So he just laughing like. What's your thoughts on that? What's going on? I mean, we ain't gotta say who did or what. What you know, like yeah, who yeah, did it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm but I'm hearing it did happen at the workplace. It's an easy W. Better hope it didn't. A lot of insides say uh, it, Ooh, yeah. easy W. <laughs> <laughs> when I first heard about, it, I was like, easy W. I was like, this. I don't know if this is real, and, and then That's real credible of... source confirmed it. Hey, Dejan, hit me up. I, we could call a truce if you got a problem with me, but I got a lawyer that will milk. For everything, I just need twenty percent. I just need twenty percent. Now give me ten percent. I got a lawyer that will take the house, the cars, the everything. Holy, they coming for company. everything. Everything, everything, everything will be in your name, brother. Adam I just need ten percent. Adam, they coming for plug talk. They coming for no jumper. They, they coming, coming for Lino. They gonna take Lino with them. No. <laughs> That's a I'd part have, of the lawyer. Yes. I'd have Lino over my shoulders. <laughs> I'd be like, Look. Put it over and just throw out the house with her too. That's part of the deal That's that the lawyer is drawing up. Yeah. So She's coming with me too. Now the rumor it's it's getting more and more out there. This is not no jumper talking about it. This is their quote unquote ops mm -hmm. community. And they and AD who's very connected in the LA streets has inside. He says you know inside information, inside sources yeah. say, and he they have somebody over at No Jumper. I think there's a mole at No Jumper. Mm. Big one. You know what I'm saying? Who's sending information over to AD and the men's, right? Yeah, Reliable they say source. They say, I think they say it. You no, know, they say it, right? Yeah. But no jumper, like I said, have never said, yo, one of our security shot um, Dijon. Because that's civil war. <laughs> bro, that's a, that's a lawsuit. If I, admitting to a crime. <laughs> bro, that's, that's such a W. Ooh. In Cali. He's just going to have to go. I, I, I can't see, hear loud noises again. Ooh, I can't like, go to work, full time job again. Adam owes me money. <sighs> that's a heavy one. Like, there's one thing if like a fight happens and you broke your nose, or like you get shot outside of the workplace. It's like it's not on me. Like, you know, get well uh, soon. And hope to see you again. You know what I'm saying? But like, yeah. If the, like, can we speculate for a second? What can happen that you get shot by security? You touch. I don't him. think the security shot him. I think maybe did something happen and he got hit while in the commotion. Yeah, but then why are you taking uh, no jumper out your bio? Because he's like, well, I got shot in the workplace. I'm mad. Uh, then he being gay. You know what he's I mean? gay. Yeah, he being gay. <laughs> Shouldn't have him there. He's uh, actually gay. He's, he's actually, actually gay. Uh, but would the that might make it worse. would the punishment be on the security guard? Yeah, that's gonna make it. Would it be worse. on the security guard or would it be on Adam Twenty Two? How like legit is their work contract? No, the guy goes like, to jail who shot him, right? Mm -hmm. And then I'm turning around and I'm suing Adam Twenty Two for plug talk and his and his girl. So security aren't licensed to shoot. No, the the security that they have there, and I'm just, I don't know for sure for sure, but they've talked about it enough times that I would imagine that they have a licensed yeah. firearm carrying security guard, right? Mm -hmm. And they are separately are licensed firearm carriers. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like Adam has talked about having the having the blimey pack on him. Flacco's talking about having the, having the the legal firearm, like. It's a thing like, you know, go get yourself. It's kind of harder in L.A., but you can do it as far as security. Yeah. If security shoots you. Yeah. OK. And I'm just going from my own legal non-trained brain. If security shoots you, yes, yeah. you can sue the security. You can. Yeah. But the thing is, you got hurt inside of the workplace. The vicinities. And that person who shot you is hired by that company um, everybody getting sued and everybody going to jail so adam getting screwed on both adam's liable if both? as very the owner much. of the company yeah, if, if he much. was shot outside of the the property then maybe it would be a criminal just the security guard would get the shit. yeah exactly we, we could argue that in court and not put no jumper liable we don't know neither if they got shot inside of the workplace like we just know that the man got shot at or, this point or if he was working if the security guard was working like on the clock. That that also plays a factor or, or in court. Does him yeah. and the security guard have a, have a relationship? Yeah. Mm. 
Uh, what do you think shoot the man for? Crazy. <laughs> what do you just shoot the man for? Uh, <laughs> that's a passion thing, dog. That's, that's a, like what the hell? It's crime of passion. This is it's, it's a, a crime a real of passion. Thing. How you just shoot the, the, the dude? He came to work and you just decided that he he's, was cheating on me, right? Bam. Or you found out he has a next man. What's yeah. going on, right? The only way they can get out of it is if there was an altercation or he was trespassing. Self defense. Yeah, yeah, but that man was at work, dog. If he was just did a podcast the and and the security just came up and blamed him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That if seems kind of weird. Like, did he have something going on with the security guard? Dunzos. And yeah, the fact that he's gay is gonna make it ten times. Oh, worse, it bro. makes the it already worse. It's a hate crazy. crime now. Yeah, it's a hate crime. <laughs> and then Adam, Adam's trying to just join those worlds together. So he's probably like, yeah, let's have a guy who's you know LGBTQ uh, security. Guard. Guard, and then we got now you know what i mean he's spreading out the work <laughs> dusty's making a movie out he's of spreading the out the work <laughs> he in trouble he this is guy made trouble. a love triangle in this one <laughs> yeah i can't wait to see episode two <laughs> bro he's like, no that's a love triangle thing there's no way i'm just shooting somebody because they're gay like you know what i'm saying like what do you just shoot him for because he's gay but well, shoot him don't expose me? me what about wow. now that he's, he's thank you you know you're about hey, you're about to expose me, me? bow bow, bow. Thank but, you. But he didn't kill him. He's he still no, talking. Warning shot. It's a warning shot. It was a oh, Legos. The next time crutches. I kill you. Like yeah. He didn't shoot him in his dick. My boy told me that if a guy gives you a Legos, he didn't really want you to die. It's more like a lesson. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a warning has your shot. Boy been, has your boy been shot before? He is not. All right. And he doesn't know what a Legos is. A Legos, you can still die. You can still die from a Legos, but you can I do get cut, it. Bro. Like, we didn't want to kill you, but, but you, you could have you you killed me. Still, so you can you hit a major artery, bro. Yeah, like, dad, yo. I know a man that, that died, and he was five min- He just, was right across the street from the hospital. Yeah. Got yeah. licking him leg and just bleed shot out on dead. You die off a shock. No. Yeah, fam. You could die off a shock, or if you hit a major artery, artery in the leg, the blood. you're out of there. You're out of there, But bro. it is the majority of Legos, yeah. It is a warning shot. In in It's supposed to be a warning shot until you find out, oh, damn, I killed him. Oh, my God, he's on the news. Right, Shit, I only hit him in the leg. Yeah, yeah, but he died from a leg. Guys, <laughs> huh? You're done. Right? You're still going to jail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. But um, last thing on this, what do y'all think about him taking the no jumper out his bio though? Well, that means because he's been exposed, and he he was going to expose now the, the the security guard. No, no, but he's the one who said he didn't like nobody exposed him for being gay. Or he's anything. the one who came out. I'm saying yeah. he's going to expose the security guard. There's a love triangle here, bro. But yo, if you're if you're looking to get some type of compensation from your employer, like you're not gonna quit. You know what I'm saying? Maybe he was fired. No, you no. quit. You don't Unless go back. That means you 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 actually want the abuse. Like that that means you actually yeah. are comfortable with being shot at your job. Oh, you so you gotta show, right that, show that you left the unsafe environment. Yeah, or very much so. You yeah, separate yourself. You if separate you're still yourself. friends with them, how's that gonna go in court? You now you're suing me. Well, um, I thought I'll, maybe get like the benefits from still like I don't know if no jumper offers not gonna pay. benefits. No, I don't think <laughs> so. <laughs> they like, get like two hundred like dollars every two weeks, bro. No, 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 not that little. Every but. week, <laughs> these guys wouldn't be able to. Two hundred like, a week be is able to eat, crazy. Bro. America, they can't America, even pay America, gas to get America's there. different though. You know what I'm saying? From what like, what I heard with the T-Rail thing, I was like six bills a, a, yeah. a, a week or something like a that. Week. But then he was getting lowballed. But I don't want to dig in their pockets like that. Well, let's salute to Dijon. We'll, we'll see what happens with him. Great man. poupon. <laughs> right? Well, I'm going to wait for point and shoot. Point and Great shoot. Poupon. Drop a video on this guy, man. You know what I'm saying? We need Dijon. a point and shoot. Dijon Mustard. Great Dijon. Yeah, that's, 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 that's too old for, for, they, these, for these guys, they, man. Yo. They don't, you don't remember the commercial. Do you have any Grey Poupon? I'm going to bring you back. That's, that's why we have you. Nah, I know what Dijon Mustard is. Though. That's Grey Poupon. Grey Poupon. The, the, yeah. um, oh, okay. Grey Poupon. Bring you guys back to... Give you See, a little history lesson. A little history lesson. <laughs> the finer All things in life. <laughs> Happily, <laughs> some are affordable, like Grey Poupon Dijon mustard. <laughs> Grey Poupon is so fine, it's even made with white wine. Its original That's fresh Dijon recipe no, I can make this adds stuff. distinctive flavor scratch. to beef, pork, and poultry, salad dressing and sauces, and of course, sandwiches. Wait for the so hook. enjoy one of life's <laughs> finer <laughs> pleasures. Pardon me. Would you have any Grey Poupon? But of course. Grey Poupon. <laughs> but right? of course. But it's called Dijon Mustard. <laughs> bro, when you guys grow up in the 60s, when you see no, this commercial, you know, in the 80s and the 90s, dog, is the best times. I wouldn't want to grow up when you guys grew up. This looks like a commercial. Course, that just there's alien things are going on over They look like side. they just dropped color TV when this commercial <laughs> No, that's when you had to beat the box. Them times you, you had a little box, or we had the Rogers box. Oh, The man. brown Rogers box, or you had the brown little, or you had the black little Rogers box. We old as dirt, bro. Yeah, dog, I don't give a shit. I still whoop their ass. Um, but salute. 
to to, to Dijon, <laughs> Dijon mustard, aka Dijon. Grey Poupon, aka yeah. Dijon. Do you have any Paul? Grey Poupon? <laughs> but of course, but of course, do you have any Grey Poupon? <laughs> I can't wait to cut that into the video. <laughs> right? Um, I got <laughs> one last one here. We just pearly things. Remember, Sorry, remember just pearly things. The girl Pearl Davis. Yeah, the the right wing. Y'all loved, actually. Hold on, B three. That was that was that's your that's your home girl, fam. What do you mean? Just pearly things. You were defending her last time we brought her up, bro. Oh, the, the, oh, that girl. She's annoying. <laughs> she lost her YouTube channel last time that we, we brought her up, right? Sorry. Or no, she didn't lose her YouTube okay. channel. She got demonetized, right? Her. I don't want to say good for that because we've been there before. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fuck two times. So. Yeah, nah, I'm alright. <laughs> just true. I'm alright. I don't right? want karma coming in a see-through exactly. dress and stilettos for my ass, too. right? But <laughs> her fresh and fit. Fresh and fit was first. Yeah, and. Actually, not fresh and fit. Let's really take it back. Like Nick Fuentes, oh all those different God. people like that. They were first. Yeah. Alex Jones, all those yeah. guys. They those were first. Guys. On the right wing side of the media. Yes. Like those are the new guys. media. Yeah, even Tate, demonetized. Even, oh. Andrew Tate. Yeah, yes. Yeah. He, he was before Fresh and Fit. He got yeah. demonetized or yep. lost his YouTube channel. Yeah. And Fresh and Fit was more the most I guess one of the more popular because of their show. Yeah. When they got demonetized, that's when you started really seeing the trend really happening. But then Pearl got hit with it too, and that was like two months ago. Mm. One thing with demonetization, you can you can apply for an appeal, like I did, and won the appeal. She didn't win the appeal. Damn. And Why? and in this video, she also mentions that she deleted twenty thousand videos. She deleted them. Yes, because one of the things, like I'll give you guys some some more like insight, right? Mm. The first time um, the demonetization happened was because of the style of co the content that was on the channel. Mm. We used to smoke like crazy on, like we still we're still the most smoked out podcast, and we yeah, still but, smoke. Yeah, but and we're but, doing good though. No, but I don't show it on camera. That like I'm almost to that point too. Like I don't want to smoke on it. But well, anyways, go on. I, I I listen. I smoke like maybe two blunts an episode, but in yeah. the editing process, you don't really see too much smoking. Too much. I cut yeah. the when somebody's smoking, I cut that out. And I cut to the person who's not smoking. What about yeah. the lives you do? You, you do. I see lives. The blunt in his head. That's kind of unpreventable. Cool. Yeah. So I, I try to like if I'm sparking my blunt, I try to keep it low, and then I just take a few puffs, put it back on the ashtray. Mm. But you know what I'm saying? That could be problematic. Okay. What ended up happening is I had to delete a bunch of videos. Like I'm talking about 150 videos that were smoking in them. Right. Big interviews, like the Young Lava interview, the Smiley interview, bare interviews where I used to have a lot of the full shots of the of the of the frame and everybody smoking and we were passing blunts those times, was different times before mm -hmm. COVID. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So I I could understand deleting videos, but 20,000 videos she deleted. And I, sorry, just to finish that, once I deleted the videos, then I reapplied. I did the the appeal. They seen, okay, everything, the coast is clear. You guys can have the monetization back. Hmm. Pearl deleted 20,000 videos and they still said no. Damn. Well, hey, I thought it would only be free her. Okay. Um, so as you guys know, back in November, we were demonetized. A lot of people, you know, they said that we were demonetized um, for stuff we weren't. Officially, what YouTube told us was that we were demonetized for using the word um, Fanny, let's just say, with a T and an R, and that women are not as smart as men. <laughs> that's what I, that's, I'm quoting YouTube. Um, and it was really frustrating because I even had a meeting with them and I asked them if I could statistically back up the things that I was saying. Would that help anything? They said no. Okay. And this caused us to delete probably, what, blessing 10,000 videos? Oh, 20,000 videos. 20, so the last 000. four years, I, I learned to edit four years ago. And it's like, we've had so many people that have put in so much work here, you know, like blessings slept on the floor of our studio. <laughs> you know, um, there's people that have put in like hundreds of hours. And it was a really tough decision um, deciding to delete 20,000 videos because um, I, I don't know, it's four years worth of work. But, you know, in my head, the upside was that maybe we could get remonetized and we could just be more careful going forward. We did back them up and they're going on the website, but um, and we were hoping that this would let, lead us to getting remonetized. Um, we love and unfortunately, I learned um, I learned two days ago that they denied our decision. Um, I'm not mad at YouTube. YouTube has the right to require whatever they want on their platform, but it's very frustrating because they never they, they wouldn't tell us why they denied it. They wouldn't tell us anything other than hate speech. And that's such a broad definition that we can't even really. So hate speech is what they said. 
she's saying that it was her two statements um that women or men are, men are statistically smarter than women mm-hmm. and she's like I guess I could, I could even show you. I could even prove it to you with, st- with the stats, which is crazy. <laughs> like, like, and the other one was for her using the um, a derogatory term for transvesti- uh, trans- transgender. Transgender. I'm sorry. I didn't what, say what the other one. What did she word. use? What did she use? She used um, granny, but with a T and an R. Oh. <laughs> don't, make, don't make me have to cut that part uh, <laughs> what, what, what am I wrong no but transgender is the proper term no, yes 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 right? yes yes and yes, she was yes. just probably just flipping the granny word all over the place yeah yeah and YouTube ain't having that no no YouTube ain't having that yeah they're not having I don't think it was she's saying it was the women statistically smarter than or men statistically started smarter than women yeah I don't, I don't even think that. it's that I don't think it's that. No, there's probably there's documentaries and there's like like YouTuber YouTube channels that are dedicated to like deciphering things like that and shit. And yeah. they say that stuff. I Even think if it it's w- not a, it's an unpopular opinion or if it's a popular opinion or not, like it's not like the end of the world to say that. You know? I think maybe that might have added on. But she also had a whole song where she was singing about the Jewish people, bro. Yeah, bro. With the with the uh, with the banjo and stuff like that. Yeah. Like, come on, fam. Like, she's crashing out, bro. Or what, she, what, we're not what, crashing. What, what out. is she? She's just a white chick from like um somewhere in the Midwest or something. I think, bro. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wish she have all this money to like do all this. She she has money. Her parents have money. That's what it is. She has a fan base too, though. But a huge yeah, but fan I didn't realize okay, her parents had money too. Yeah, because yeah. four years ago, she said people were sleeping on the the studio floor, hundreds of hours. In like, how do you pay these people? What studio floor? How'd you get the studio floor? Well, she yeah, are, she already no, had like, know, the, like, the yeah, stimmy, yeah, right? Oh, she her, from, her, her, from, from her parents already. From her put, parents, exactly. Right, who are the, the initial putting her on, right? Who are, they're not. They're just rich. They're not like, rich, but they're just well off like regular they people. Own farms and shit. Eh? Oh, whatever. Midwest. <laughs> but her YouTube channel is very successful as well. Yeah. Right. Or her YouTube and whatever other platform she's on. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's not like after a while she can't be paying for a lot of that stuff out of her YouTube check. Like, she gets paid for appearances too in like university. She was on Piers Morgan and shit yeah, the other day, bro. Yeah, I know. You know what I'm saying? Like she gets around. Like she's significant. She's very popular, but. That YouTube income, like for what she p- was pulling in, imagine twenty thousand videos. She probably has videos that have millions of oh, views yes. on them. Okay, once that's demonetized, it's like, why are you even uploading? No, because now she, because everybody's gonna go to her subscription based her website. Platforms. Yeah, she has all them there. Yeah, I think she should do that <laughs> or do the Rumble route. That's if she can stay relevant. Because I gotta say, like, this is the first time we've talked about Pearl in a while. Yeah, true. Well, she's not every meant day. to be spoken about. Every, she's not meant to be spoken about every week, though. Well, That's real. She's not that interesting. She's well, she, that if she's trying to compete in the whole RP world, red pill world, or whatever. Her job is to stay viral. Like yeah. Myron just smashed a glass on the ground the other day, fam. That's viral, bro. I know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like those. Also, quick thing before we get off of this, can we agree that the red pill, the red pill sphere, is kind of dying? What do you mean? Like, my guys, like, everything's, like, it was hot maybe two years ago, like, real hot. Well, it's because everything's now being kind of really exposed. And we don't, like, those people don't really have to say too much because it's really in your face now. Pause. No, I think, I think RP is is here to stay. It's here to stay, but it's not as buzzing. Like, fam, RIP Kevin Samuels, when he was alive, that, it was on fire. Fire. fire like you could not see nothing but rp stuff on the timeline bro yeah and over the last and even after him with tate and all these the different people that came after these guys really had to play shaking crazy and then just the internet or the youtube and the powers that be just started cleaning shop and the quote-unquote matrix or whatever because fam tate's locked up they mm-hmm. took out sneako they took out all bare people like that were really pushing that agenda you know what i'm saying yeah. fresh and fit yeah Yeah, you're right. But I think the need for RP is still there because a lot of it is young people just looking for guidance Mm, on how to be a stronger man. I mean, sometimes there's some bad stuff in the forums, but I think the intention behind like seeking RP content is like self betterment and like how not to get finessed by chicks and how to get chicks. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of RP is like helping guys get girls and like helping guys like 
focus on what matters like building your body building your business whatever you know it should be yeah that's the intentions original intentions r.i.p uh kevin samuels once again yeah he was the one that was like one of the more real ones even though people were trying to expose him for gay rumors and stuff yeah but like the guys who were pushing the rp they're all getting like exposed exposed yeah, bro. you're right you're right so like the leaders of it like fam tate and fresh and fit and there was one more guy the guy with the ponytail um and he's supposed to be the godfather of of red pill like and they all like big him up mm-hmm. <laughs> and he's been on fresh and fit enough yeah, times yeah. the people in the audience who follow this shit they'll know who i'm talking about right yeah. there's a white guy he has like he's bald pretty much but he <laughs> just has his yeah, ponytail know. holding on to he always has a hat on or like he has like a, no, I've a, seen him. a head tie on his head <laughs> he looks crazy that's like these are your kings these are your goats <laughs> like no bro fresh is like uh, he, rollo tom Tom Tomasa, Tom, uh, Tomasi? Tomasi Tomasi thank you Roto thank Tomasi. you <laughs> like sometimes yo. called the godfather of red pill yes. has been a permanent fixture in the manosphere Gosh, for squash. 20 years <laughs> these guys look crazy fam oh there's the next guy the light skinned dude who's like oh you guys man uh, he, he, he talks like that oh you guys man uh, you guys really think you guys got it going on he got, he, he got married to his they exposed him because he said he doesn't date women over a certain age. Then they exposed this guy because this woman is like 40-something years old, had a kid already that wasn't his kid. So then he did a whole marriage, <laughs> and he was the guy who was giving, who was the priest, basically. <laughs> he was like, by the power invested in me, <laughs> I pronounce us man and wife. <laughs> like, these are the guys who are running the red pill, fam. Yo, you don't need a priest to tell you you're married to any woman, though. That's crazy. But fam, like as a kid, like like you said, the red pill, yeah. it, it, the, in essence, it's supposed to be good for like young men. Mm-hmm. But when they're looking at the guys who are supposed to be pushing the shit, Peeps. Pips squeaks. <laughs> it's like, I don't know who to follow. I know. <laughs> this is who you guys want me to follow, this pip squeak. Like they need to, like the, the RP community needs an emergence of somebody who really is really about what they're talking yeah, about. Really right? strong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry. Let's go. We need, we need young shawarma here, up. Man. Start going on daily runs. Start <laughs> vlogging it. <laughs> <laughs> For all your red pill needs, hit up Young Sharma. Right. Yeah, yeah, hit yeah. me up if you need advice. I guess. Uh, yeah, yeah. Am, we got, am, we am I wrong though? Call. Like they need somebody right now, fam. It's it's looking rough out here, bro. Who's yeah, left? I would look too much like a pimp if I was trying to do it. <laughs> it look crazy. Oh, what's the? Oh, what's that one guy? Oh my goodness, I'm forgetting. He's he's the black dude. He snitches on. He's he's beefing with friggin' um. He was beefing with King Vaughn. Charleston, oh, White. Charleston White. Charleston White. Charleston. He's not the king of the red pill. No, bro. but he's like, pretty he's, prominent he's right the now. King of, <laughs> he's just he's too he's not focused enough to stay on that. Like mm. Myron, uh, would be, people can say what they want about Myron. He, he's pretty on point with his rants and like how yeah. he tries to really push the agenda. It's just that he has a lot of skeletons in his closet That's too, too. Fam. Patrick, but David, Patrick, but David is. I don't know who that is. You know the guy who has uh oh. Uh, I don't even know is it's like Lion Entertainment, Lion something media, Patrick but David. He's a billionaire, I think, but he has a pretty prominent channel. And I'd say he's red pill. I, I see um I tipped in Pat is the first one that pops up. Right. There's also <laughs> um the guys who do the whatever podcast. Okay. I don't know the names of the host, but the white the white guy who's the who's mm-hmm. always who's I think he's the one host there. Yeah. They're pretty good. That guy yeah. sounds pretty level minded. And I'll give one more. But a lot of people might think he's a little wild. Mediocre tutorial reviews. MTR. Mm. MTR. Yeah. Right? Light skin dude with the glasses. Mm. He's pretty focused. He says on code with what he's talking about. He doesn't have any dirt that's coming out about him. Yeah. That he's not saying. He's not practicing what he's preaching. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm. So I'll, I'll give those guys, if there's a manosphere or RP community that people can at least listen to and they're not going to get guided the wrong way. Who was the guy you mentioned again? Patrick uh, David. He's married, has four kids. Who, Patrick David? Yeah. He's a standout guy. He was a military guy, started a business. Now he has like a podcast empire and like... He, I know about him. He has really good He owns content. a percentage of the Yankees. Yeah. boy. Look, because remember, even the other guy, something Jackson, he got exposed. Yeah. <laughs> this, this there's nobody left, weirdos. bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nobody's a weirdo now. So salute to the RP community. And uh, listen, I, I don't know what to say about you, pro. You know what I'm saying? She, she might just have to just pack it up. Just stop. 
<laughs> um, let's get out of here, man. We got a two-hour pod there. Yeah, right. Mm-hmm. We love hip hop.